All right, welcome, chat. We're on global first. All right, there's maintenance on the test server. Perfectly aligned with global NA reset. Let me get this out of the way first. Alrighty. Huh? Huh? Did you see BB new model and merge? What the heck? What? We have BB bots now? What in the heck? What the fuck? I'm so confused right now. Look here, silly. All right, whatever. All right, let me finish uh, end of the week stuff quickly. Did I even play this account today, this week? Did I do anything? Bygone 45 climb? Shit, I got a cloak on. Get it real quick. Alright. Right before reset, that's perfect. Alrighty. 
I gotta actually farm field energy. It's a field bad, man. After seeing that new device in 3.6. Oh, I gotta do this. Fuck. You did all weekly balls rounds before yes before bed yesterday. <laughs> oh god. Do I actually have to? I don't want to play anymore. Nope. Lazy mode activated. Fuck that, man. All right. It's been activated since forever, okay? Did I not do Frontier Clash? Oh, I just never accepted the task. Never mind. Let's play all this shit. Uh, did I ever farm dreams on this account? I don't even fucking remember. How is the clown girl? He got a bit, cha bit changed. Rotation turned a bit smoother. We'll, we'll look at the patch notes later. She's alright though. We get to actually see how much damage she does. One seventy four. Fuck it, man. I'm just sell it. Here. Did any Billy Billy streamer cook yesterday? I mean, most of them did. Yesterday, you can't cook yesterday. You can't like verify your cooking because Cactus was bugged. And so I don't think anyone did. How many stars? I got the A1. We'll do A3 during anniversary. Ooh, 200. 260. I fucking buy this too. There we go. How many do I have now? All right, balance drone up one time. When will it release on global? The character? Reboot? I have a YouTube chatter asking. YouTube chatter is demanding transfer. It's not even confirmed for global. Why are you why, why are you all angry? Uh, 
let's go. You think we get the Fenrir skin together with Cien like Lin skin? Nope. Not gonna happen. Fenrir skin will probably happen for us on our half anniversary, maybe? I guess. People on Ida, you try and tell them things? What the fuck? I swear to god, like, most of the people at Ida Cafe still don't even fucking play this game anymore. Which server on CN bangies? fucking cry. I can't see shit. I can see nothing. Gameplay. Oh shit. do one more i'll do another run after reset and then we, we're, we're good right okay what what else
Nine more days for this. Eleven hours for this. Do I have to farm this out? I should get this, right? I should still get this. Alright, uh, what else are we doing? Spiritual clash. Do a van, you'll shoot my tiles? Sure you will. Sure you will. Uh... Anything else to do here today? The end of the week? Did I do everything? Raid cleared, frontier cleared, everything cleared. Dust shop. Everything bought. I didn't buy this. Whoops. Oh, well, let's see. Home Island. What the fuck is Sussy's that? What, what badge is Twitch Recap 2023? The fuck is that badge? What the hell is that? Never seen it before. Yeah, why don't they let us buy it from outside? I didn't even buy the monthly ones. What the shit? Okay, my bad. Surely this is still relevant content. You need to play their game? You have to play a Twitch game? Twitch has a game? But why? Bro, how is my island still fucking extinct? Like, my island's bugged, chat. There has been no signs of life for like months. Artificial Island Devlog 2 at the end of the missions tab? Is that a reference to the CN meme? I mean, the entire Artificial Island was to reference all their fucked up shit that they've done in 1.0. That's why it got deleted. Because it's no, no, it's not relevant in the reboot servers because people don't, don't know. What fucked up shit? They don't. It don't exist no more. Okay. No one will know if they they delete it. Uh, thirteen more minutes. Do I grind out this event? I still have PlayStation to grind out. That's the biggest problem right now. Is this good to AFK? No, 
Nothing's matching. AFK on your phone while doing... I actually? That's a good idea. What trait is best when using triple altered? Uh, a Fiona trait, I guess? It depends on what you're trying to do. I should AFK this on my phone. That's a, that's a really good idea. But how do I AFK the PlayStation version? Bro, everyone is trying. Okay, I give up. Let's do PlayStation. I fucking give up. Why? Like, how is there this many tryhards? Like, bro, that's crazy. the fuck is my cursor out yeah the, the racing was good but then no I pretty much capped it every time racing was fine it's just like tryhards are keeping global alive global's never dead uh maybe now it is what happened to PlayStation servers hello back what are we doing what do we need to do why are all the CN servers down are they is there maintenance on the actual CN servers as well or am I getting one guide Fucker. Wait, why isn't this tracking? What the fuck are desert predators? Am I just on them right now? Okay, that's why. I don't work with these fucking weird ass Tencent localized names, okay? I have no idea what the fuck they're supposed to be. I need to kill three more of these first. Oh, 
Oh, PS version is gonna be more alive and it's gonna stay alive way longer than Tencent version. That's for sure, for sure. Okay. Because it's actually run by Perfect World. The 10 years apply more to this version than the Tencent version. It'll probably last all the way until the PS7 or some shit. This isn't the test server. Fucking read the goddamn title. Weird ass YouTube chatters, man. There's maintenance right now. Why am I toxic? Always been toxic, okay? We've always been the toxic Toph community. How do you know? R read the fucking title. See, this is the thing, okay? Wait, why the fuck did I enter? This is the thing. If you're called stupid and you're actually offended by it, then you're actually stupid. Okay. So, I, I'm sorry for you. Need to actually try and finish how much time do we have four minutes fuck am i gonna even finish this i don't think so uh i don't think i can even finish this i don't think it's possible Awkward. Fucking awkward. Oh well, minus 150 DC. It is what it is. We'll save all of these attempts for... Uh... It's PlayStation. I swipe here. It don't fucking matter if I miss the DC or not. It's four minutes. It's not possible. I don't have time to finish everything. Uh... Especially not with this this UI and the fucking slow menu navigation. There's four minutes left. I I it's possible, but not not with the time. Okay. So. Let's do a join up. Fuck. Why did I enter? I keep pressing the wrong goddamn button. The entirety of Aquaville gonna be dropped in 3.6. Apparently that's how it is, yeah. Can I please match? Surely there's people matching. I 
I can't wait for the Sing Tian raid on PlayStation. It's gonna be a shit show. It's gonna be amazing. Let's see, surely we'll be able to match join offs, right? I honestly can't wait. It's, it's gonna be so good. What's up with the internet on the PlayStation server? It's like... What is up with the internet? Commander is super powerful Galileo. No, I really don't understand. My router is sitting right next to it. It's on Wi-Fi, sure. I was too lazy to make an Ethernet cable for it, but it's like, how is it this bad? What happened? I really don't understand. You hope Hotta will release an anniversary song like the first one? They did. It's on my YouTube channel. The heck? Like, you, you should know as a YouTube chatter. <laughs> You're literally on YouTube. Uh, am I being trolled right now? Hey, 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 toxic tough community. Let's not be toxic, okay? Let's not be toxic. to clear my bag what the fuck all right hold on uh where's my how's my bag fucking full like what the shit there's so much purple garbage in here Did I buy this shit yet? No. I still can't afford anything. What the fuck, man? I mean, I haven't even farmed out the entire thing. Okay, so basically, what I'm gonna do is finish my bounty. There's CBT for Toph Reboot, yes. We'll be testing it again, or I mean, we tested it yesterday, were you not here? We do Void Abyss for the event. When is the event ending? I need to actually fix my internet, remind me.
nine days. Right, right after we finish testing all this bullshit this week, we'll find time to actually clear all the PlayStation stuff. Wait, it's Monday, right? Did I did I do the version delivery thing? Did they say anything about PlayStation? Oh, I did the top ambassador. Never fucking mind. Okay. I was like, do I have to do ambassador voting again? But then... I don't have to. We're chilling. Oh god, a horror beast. Where am I supposed to even find a horror beast? Wasn't there one like right here? No one bids on PlayStation. Nobody. I mean, I don't know how the PlayStation servers are still alive. There's still plenty of people playing, but like none of them actually play the actual, like all the content. Like, I don't know what they're doing. Was this supposed to be a fucking horror? Okay, wait. Nope, missed it. What the heck? Ten K Mira is quite easy. It's not even ten K Mira. I wonder if the test of her maintenance is done. Marker always rebates me. Level 92. Let's quickly do this. You still see Billy Billy streaming 3.6 test? I know. It's it should be live. Or they never took down the servers. That's what they do now. They apply fixes, but they don't take out take down the servers. But like what's the point of testing when the fix is not there? Nice grapple. Nice polished game. Good evening. 
Good morning, wherever you are. All right, I need to just clear everything here and then we're done. And then we go test. Fine match. Holy shit, we found a person. That's insane. Is using phone while charging make your battery bloated? I mean, if you have a 10 year old phone, probably maybe. The fuck? We're almost in 2024. They have long solved the using phone and charging problem. Unless, I don't know, you're using some piece of shit. I mean, to be safe, it's still better not to, but like, you know. I still won't charge my phone in bed and put it underneath my pillow or something. That's fucking stupid. Besides that, it, it is what it is. Nine recommended star. Don't need stars. If you can't get one, get one. Free to play damage. All right, let me get the hell out of here. How is Toph Remake the third doing for me? This is, we're still testing, okay. Soon. I think I'm dead. Alright, time to get carried. We do this. Match? Bro, no one is matching. Anything noteworthy for a plotty test? Uh, actually, some things. The fucking cooldown reset got changed from two dashes to one dash. Some passive multiplier nerfs. Actually, 
kind of significant gameplay changes compared to like our previous test servers where they they changed nothing and it was just bug fixes Oh shit, we're getting carried. Kinda weird seeing the cactus die. Yep. Yeah, they fixed Cactus yesterday towards the later end of the test server. Holy fucking lag. What characters are screwed over with the adjustments? We're we talking about reboot. What? No one got screwed over. Why would anything get get, get screwed over? Really? What? I'll quickly do this. We'll find a match, right? Reboot. It's a no, no one gets screwed over because you can't get screwed over. It's a fresh server. <laughs> Tian is a tank now. Sure. Did they nerf Nyan's ultimate and dash hold? Wait, what? You can't dash forward. That's just how the character works. You just don't dash. Okay, I'm not we're not we're not matching anybody. Let's just fucking go. Tian is a tank. Tian got kind of reworked significantly. <laughs> Characters actually match their roles now. They have a breakdown chart. We have off field buffers. We have shield break. We have shatter. We have heal. We have like. On field DPS, it's like all kinds of different shit.
over there. How is Reboot going to affect LeBron's legacy? What the fuck? That's it all. I've heard about this meme, but like, where did it come from? Where the fuck did it come from? Bro, why can't we find the last goddamn key? Come on. God damn it, finally. I don't know why the PlayStation is. Why is the connection so bad? The router is literally right next to me. I'm so confused. <laughs> Alright, we're done. Kick by. Out of this party, PlayStation wheel. Thanks for the PlayStation runs. I'm gonna do this for the rest, and we are done. Raid? Wait, there's a raid. Fuck, man. We'll do that when we come do v VA. We still kind of need to clear VA. Cause like we're just gonna do heroic anyway. What is the raid today? Why PS UI so garbage? What do you mean? It's literally the same UI. What the fuck? Fine. Just 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 do heroic. Clear it in two seconds. Let's go. Send it. Like, bringing up the cursor is now easy, it's just like, if we already bringing up the server with the touchpad, why not just use the goddamn touchpad to control the cursor? That part I don't get. Hey. Kick by. Great run. Great run, great run. Been a while since you saw this game. How's it going? 
it's going absolutely great yes very good All right, I'll quickly finish this. Yes, great, very good. Oh, uh, one more balance join up and then we go test. And then I need to like grind out this event somehow. How do I grind out the P the, the PlayStation event? It kind of sucks because I can't see the fucking I can't see the screen. Cause I, I just want an AFK Candy Crush. That's all I want to do. The shooting event has a plenty of people queuing up. Yep. It's just... Why does the event end now? I don't understand their like event planning and timing. Patch isn't... Like, why? No, Classic and Reboot has two different devs team, dev teams. This is basically the situation that happened with RuneScape. Pretty much. This seems like a good prize. Fucking sell. Oh shit. Sell these two. Can't you queue for Clash Royale with someone? You can't queue with. I mean... You can't queue in a party, you have to like actually... Snipe, snipe, yeah. This is a good prize, I'm gonna buy this. Wait, it's election day, huh? Hold on. See how bad it is. It's like 27 minutes in, right? The current bid is a thousand. Like, I don't know if pe what, why people are complaining. Like, fucking just bid. Have an alt queue first and steal whoever is queuing, then match simultaneously with main. The fuck? That requires me to run three PlayStation accounts. That requires me to have three PlayStation accounts. Or no, three different PlayStation. Bruh. Reboot server is single player game like Genshin, right? We thought. We thought it was. It's it's try hard MMO game. That's just like Genshin. It's like Genshin try hard MMO. I don't I don't fucking know what they're cooking, but uh 
It's definitely not for casuals. The thing is, the reboot server is going to do fine. It's just none of us will, will, will do anything with it. I don't know what they're cooking, man. At this point, I have no idea what they're cooking. Surely we'll be able to find balance right on match. I need to set up my third monitor to actually do like PlayStation shit on the side, I guess. No, no sniper balanced join off. Let's see. First time. Let's see. The real question is, will the Eva collab be in the reboot server? It might. Imagine the collab would be reboot exclusive. Because fuck all the old players, right? I would laugh. It would be good. Piker has been upgrading their fence for 13 months. I'll let Pico to 13, thank you. Even on NA, there's still people insisting on using current comps. I know, right? Like, people are just clueless in general. They can't be bothered with tryharding and changing comps.
And we have a guy at 2 mil damage. What is bro doing, Shiro? Is bro on auto combat with Shiro? Like... This looks like auto combat, but like... What is bro doing? He has to be on auto. Bruh. Very helpful. A vote kick him? Is it time? Is it time for our first vote kick? Fuck, I'm in combat. I can't do this no more. Where? Wait, where'd he go? The bro's actually on auto combat. Auto play is a feature? Yeah. <laughs> do we? <laughs> do we bone chicken? <laughs> I mean, chat told me to do it. Chat told me to do it. Seriously? Not my fault now. None of the teammates respond to chat, it's over. Remember when Genesis was a whale crew? What happened? Oh, bro died. How was Kyrios actually good? Like, how did Kyrios predict the future? Like, the fuck? Triple Alter? Best team? For free to play? Boat kick. Right now. Remember getting carried by my whale crew leader? He was using Jetpack Crow and then he, after the nerf, half your crew left. I don't know why people just like... I mean, the people that quit because Jetpack Crow nerf will all quit anyways after other weapons, Power Creep, Jetpack Crow. It's, it's the same. It don't matter when they quit, honestly. It really didn't, re it didn't really matter. 
They would have quit. What the fuck? How is my island clean again? My island was. Wait, what? It's not even 40 minutes after reset. <laughs> Shit. Bruh. <laughs> Absolutely insane. Let me open my crew box. And good luck. 200! Let's fucking go. That's insane. Holy. Alright, we're done. Let's go test. Alright. Uh, are we done? I think so. So I'll, I'll I guess I'll I'll start queuing on my phone. Start queuing the event on my phone. I wish. Wait, can you? Wait, can you play PS Tolf on your phone? Anyone? Is that a thing? Has anyone tried any PS5 gamers play PS Tolf on their phone? I thought you, there was some sort of like remote play bullshit. All right, I'm on my phone now. All right, let's go test. There's a PlayStation remote play thing. No, cause like PS remote play is a feature. I was just wondering, like, can you do it for, for PS tall or not? Uh, let's first look at patch notes. Yeah, there are patch notes. For PS. Uh, let's see, where the fuck is my... I don't know where my cable is. Alright, I'm gonna just screenshot it. Then ship it over to the PC. Hold on. You need to download the app and stream the content to the phone. Wait, have you tried it? Does it work? Holy shit. The main story is actually cooking. I really want to do the main story, but like y'all can wait, right? The main story, we have like Nemesis shit showing up and stuff. I don't know if it's real or not. I got spoiler leaked in the test group from screenshots. Feels bad, man. Fuck. All right, all of the changes. Let me send a screenshot over.
All right, patch notes. So, patch notes. Line one, we have a... Uh, Her discharge, defense shred, or defense ignore, resistance ignore, has been buffed from 20 to 30 percent. Okay, and then uh, number two, when Papa is on the on the field, right? So under her skill, uh, to reduce the cooldown by 10 seconds, you all you only need to do one dash attack now instead of two dash attack. Okay, number three. Uh, the one star cluster bomb thing, like the, the, the exploded smaller bombs, ratios have been nerfed from 3200 to 2000. Uh, number four, optimize her plunge attack or her like shift hold plunge attack to, uh, to hide the weapon. It wasn't hiding the weapon previously. Number five. Uh, optimize skill description. Number six. Her dash attack animation speed has been changed. Uh, number seven. Skill duration is shorter than normal. So now, uh, during the entire skill duration, you can shoot six type two bullets. After you do, if you do one dash attack, you will be able to do six type two bullets. Uh, number eight. Apparently some like dash attack fix to stacking type two bullet problems, whatever the fuck that means. Number nine, uh, they optimized, they optimized the air walls in the Nyan raid, a Nyan join up. Uh, number 10. Number 10 is just like space, the spaceship map. Uh, effect errors got fixed. Some fixes to Icarus idle, idle dialogue, whatever the fuck this means. Some Icarus fixes out of nowhere. Number 12. Uh, Plotty's feet was clipping when you inspect other people, and that got fixed. Number 13. And then some, like, questing bug fixes. All right, that's it. Let's see what is going on. I need to log into my own account. I'm on Mob's account right now. Login. Test. Did they fix Cactus? That was another patch notes from yesterday. Yes, they did. They fixed towards the end of the test server. No, she doesn't have a bullet mechanic. She doesn't have a bullet mechanic. Alright, let's see. Let's just make sure the changes are actually implemented. <laughs> Where the fuck is the patch? It still says 20. They didn't apply the patch yet. Patch Dolko? 
I gave them an extra hour. Bro. And this is two dash attacks. They didn't change shit. Let me, let me, uh, hold on. What the fuck? She doesn't have the burn passive. No, no character has burn passive anymore. All the fucking mixed element characters have a, uh, like a mixed element debuff passive instead. Yeah, the patch has been applied. Maybe they forgot to apply descriptions. No, they said there's going to be maintenance and after the maintenance, the patch was going to go like I'm not getting a patch. That's what that's what felt weird. There was no update. Yeah, update's not here yet. All right, fuck it. We go, we go mess around in reboot server. Did, did reboot server get any patch notes? Let me ask Mob because he's in the test group. How about we just ask Mob through Billy Billy? He has to be streaming, right? Okay, bro is actually streaming. Okay. He's trying to do content. None of this shit is open. Whoops. Okay, so here's 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 the thing, okay? I asked him. So, so now what? Nothing to test. What do we do now? Genshin? Apparently the reboot server has no changes. Has no has not gotten a single announcement since uh the reboot servers turned on What Wecklin? There's no Wecklin.
Bread. They okay. They sent a bunch of resources today. Okay, so you can actually test. All right, I guess. All right. I guess we'll we'll play reboot. All right, I guess I guess we'll we'll play We'll play we'll play the reboot server while we wait for an actual update patch cuz they 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 sent out resources today All right, let's go reboot. Switch account back. Nothing fucking they didn't apply the plotty patches. All right, time to yoink account again. All right. So I guess they sent a bunch of resources. Oh, they, they sent it. I guess we're just going to max out all our weapons. Were you playing? Did you play today? Why do I feel like this account got cooked? Everything maxed? Okay, okay. Nice. Don't have to do the clicking stream. Alright, let's see. What the hell are we doing today? You're level 41. Is that the level cap? You grinded for five hours? Holy shit. How was it? Do we invite mob? Time to invite mob. Is 41 level cap or something? You can go to 42. Alright, I guess, uh... Let's see. I guess we can cook some different team colors. Is, that, is there even cactus? There's no cactus here. Oh shit. Wait a second. Okay. Okay, they they're they're gonna okay. Okay. The, the, okay. 
This shit is actually going live immediately. All right, they have this event page over here that I didn't even notice. Okay, this shit is going... The reboot server is going live with the two-year anniversary. Wow. Serving undercooked meat, classic hopper. Just how? So basically what this is, this is a 3.6, 3.6, last in, this is a new player recruitment event test. Okay, new player recruitment test. Right, it's a two year anniversary recruiting. So basically you're recruiting return players, new players. Does the webpage even work? It doesn't. So th their plan is to have the, I guess this is for live servers, right? You're using this existing server. They're, they're trying to let the existing player base help them recruit new players to play on the new servers. Wow, that's a great plan. And then uh, here's this, here's the event page. It, it's, it's broken so far, but all we know is if you're an old player, every day you share this event to your social medias, what do you get for it? Remember when we got 10 dark crystals? Guess what this is? Guess what this is? Take a guess. Take a wild guess. It's not even gear XP mats. It's a vehicle maintenance mats. A vehicle parts selector. They're like, oh God, they're like, all right, help us recruit, all, help us recruit new and returning players from your social media. You'll get vehicle parts box and uh, it'll be good. Okay. Let's see. All right. See, this is uh, the, the event description is out. This event will be live from December 14th. To January 25th. Right? There that means the the reboot server is, is going live immediately on anniversary. Okay. So uh basically the share the event code, new players can enter the event code and uh they can do stuff, okay. So basically in this event uh, participating, participating players need to satisfy the below requirements. Okay. Uh, you have to create a new account, new character during the event period. And this character must not have ever created a reboot server character. 
and you can't cannot have received an invite previously or created or have created a uh, a team basically you create a team as you, old players can create a team to invite reboot server fresh accounts to participate for them uh, and uh, also people that have typed in the invite code okay so basically the, what, what this is is old players create a party a team and then they recruit people it could be the same old players but then they have to uh they have to create a reboot server account and then enter the code there Okay, you can only join or create one team in this event. Now, let's see. Uh, there can be five players per team. And then you guys share, uh, share tasks, share missions from this event. And then these are the shared events. Uh, there is one, two, or three players in the team that has their account past level 50. So you have to level past level 50 in the reboot server, I guess. Right? I'm pretty sure what this is. This is what it is. And then uh, all players in the team combined has consumed over 240 gold nucleus right all, all these requirements i'm assuming is for reboot server right and then all all people on the part in the party has consumed up to 60 red nucleus and this is how you finish all the all the missions okay right Oh, okay, okay. N line number five. There we go. Because reboot server and regular servers have uh, item and gameplay design differences, uh, this event can only be participated by reboot server accounts. There we go. Uh, it's reboot exclusive. And they explain on the next line. And then uh, live server characters can participate in the live server specific event page. So they're going to make the same fucking uh, invite page for the live server as well. Okay, but you know. Sure. All event... Rewards can only be claimed once on the reboot server. Uh, if you have multiple reboot server characters, uh, the rewards will only be sent to the character that has claimed first. Okay, please be careful when claiming. So this, this confirms that they're going to open multiple reboot server accounts i mean multiple reboot servers so you can have multiple accounts or characters on different reboot servers right because like it says each account can have multiple reboot characters and it rewards will only be sent to the first one that claimed all right here we go again they're gonna open multiple reboot Bruh. servers Uh, number seven. Everybody can participate in the sharing of this event page, and the reward is a vehicle maintenance part selector box one. Uh, Uh, 
Oh, okay. This is basically uh, this invite page works across platforms. So you can uh, so if you downloaded this game from a different platform, you can still participate in a team. But basically, there's like Billy Billy server, Xiaomi server, whatever fucking other servers, right? You can still participate in the event together, right? Cross platform participation in the event in this like recruiting event. OK. And then uh, if you have any questions for this event, please contact customer service. Wow. Great event. Absolutely amazing. So uh, they're they're letting old players that are playing this game try and recruit new players to play their fucking game on a separate server. And uh, th that'll surely go well. It's like, it's like, it's like this, right? You've been playing tall for the past two years and you're like, it's fine. Finally, I can convince all my friends to play this fucking game. All right. You, you send them an invite and they'll be like, but uh, you can't play with me. Okay. You're on your own server. Unless I make my, I, unless I also go and make a new account and play with you and abandon my old account. Okay. Good job. That that that'll go well. All sorts of vehicle parts on your main. I mean I mean it, it, it makes sense. I think about it this way, right? It's just it's just been way too soon. Think about WoW Classic, think about old school RuneScape. Like these servers are launched like 10 years later or whatever the fuck for nostalgia purposes and then sure it's a separate server it has different balancing it has its own content and then you would have to make it a new account to play with your friends that are returning sure it's been only two years though what nostalgia And like, it's a fucking gotcha game. If it wasn't, if it wasn't for all the sunk, I mean, you already sunk your time into the game, right? Everybody that had sunk costs, like it's a gotcha game. They paid for all their fucking weapons. Like you don't want to, like most people don't want to abandon their existing progress. The servers are gonna fucking lag. Like, no fucking way they actually fix server lag. This isn't a seasonal game like Diablo PoE. They're trying to make it seasonal though. Like this whole reboot server, they're trying to make it seasonal. So like what they cooked up for the reboot server is fine. It's just like their execution of this whole fucking plan is like. It's dog shit. It's a seasonal gotcha. Because like they're, they're, they're trying to make this gear system seasonal. Because every season they're going to come up with a new tier of gear. And you got to like replace all of it. And then your whole purpose of playing this server is to like farm for new gear because that's all like all your power comes from gear pretty much all your power comes from gear because like look at look at these fucking weapons right look at the weapons weapons give you weapons are capped at level 140 right so they'll provide you a certain amount of base stats and then weapon like weapons give you stats pretty much that's it this is kind of seasonal so like this new server is designed to be seasonal so basically how it works 
is all your weapons, you max them all out, and they have the same amount of base stats, or similar amount of base stats, right? And then, which is really insignificant, right? All three of these weapons gave me 1,500 attack, while my gear at blue, it's not even purple, provides for the other 2,500, right? So when you get to gold gear, they're going to be like, all the gear is where the stats are. And then weapon multipliers are all standardized. And each weapon just basically has their own flavor of how you want to do damage, how you want to tank, how you want to uh, heal, right? You don't have to, you're not forced to pull for new weapons. Whenever they come out with a new weapon, it's just like, oh shit. Uh, there, I have a new way to be a, be a DPS or a brand new weapon to allow me to do the same content a different way. There won't be like weapon power creep. That's what their promise is. Right? And then your whole purpose is every season when they release a new level cap or do whatever is to farm for the newest tier of gear and then improve your stats and progress that way like the whole formula works okay this whole thing like this seasonal gameplay could work for a gacha mmo sure like it's a the plan is good but like, it's not ready yet for for 3.6 release, right? Especially when netcode is where netcode, where netcode changes. We can't really test netcode because not enough people on the server. But still, like we we did try and do frostbot, and shit was lagging. UI doesn't really need an overhaul if their target audience is these tryhard seasonal gameplay players. Like this UI is fine for a Chinese market. This is this is my biggest problem is like this whole thing for CN, yes, they can ship. But if they ship the same exact fucking thing again for global, it's gonna flop again. It's, But like, you know for a fact that Tencent will just copy paste and do no, <laughs> do nothing. It's the same game, but no power creep. Let's find out. Okay. So now you actually maxed all your weapons and then f farm for some gear. Do we go farm for a bit more? Let's check Bygone. We have people on floor 21. Mob is on floor 9. Cause like, I feel like the seasonal gameplay, as long as like new character releases will just add, basically it'll just be FOMO and new gameplay style. But like you can clear the same content regardless of if you whale or not. It, it's fine. It don't really matter.
But it feels like it's not like... Okay, that's pretty easy. Right? So like yesterday, I was using the same... So like, you can tell the power creep in this game is not dictated by weapons whatsoever. It's dictated by your, your weapon levels and gear stats. Because yesterday we were using the same... Like, if you did this on current server, you have the latest weapons. It don't matter if you level it or not. You're going to delete the content regardless. Because the fucking weapon multiplier power creep was ridiculous. But then, I don't think this helps clueless people. Like, this is maybe more in line to typical player expectations. Remember we, we went on Reddit? Remember we went on Reddit and there was people complaining? About like... How is my level zero just pulled Mimi at zero stars able to one shot everything, but my max level SR weapon with max stars and matrices unable to even clear content, right? Now people like that won't be confused anymore. I guess. Cause like all your power comes from actually leveling your weapon and leveling your gear. I can't shatter this, what the fuck? Tion please? Shatter weapon Tion? Okay there we go. This is actually not bad. This is actually not bad at all. Right, new weapon for different gameplay, but like you can clear whatever. There's no like you just have to get the relevant weapon for each of the different content. Get a tank weapon, get a heal weapon.
All right, what is this? Every time you gain a shield, you'll do damage, AoE. You have 30% more stamina consumption. Weak to Fizz. And they have 100%... What? What gives me shield? Tion is if you if your HP is below 20%, you'll gain a shield for 30 seconds. And then uh when the shield is act is active, uh you'll get hyper body for two minutes. Oh a two minute cooldown. But you'll have hyper body for 30 seconds. And then every time you go into combat, you can only trigger this effect once. That's where the shield's coming from. So weapon and matrices are kept, only levels and gear pieces are wiped, right? What do you mean? This is a new server. Nothing is kept. The fuck? It's like you're creating a new character on a different a different region. Lyra don't give shield anymore. I mean, Lyra gives a shield at six. Let's try Lyra. Sure. Lyra is a regen shatter character. Nemesis is a regen character that doesn't really do much. Uh, Claudia is an off offhand buffing weapon that buffs skill. Apparently Fenrir is a discharge buffer. Uh-huh. Fenrir is a discharge buffer, plus a charge weapon. Doesn't really do damage. We need a skill spammer, chat. Uh, Tsubasa is a basic attack and dash attack buffer. Wait, Umi is a skill DPS. Wait. Apparently Umi is a skill based DPS. Okay. Let's try Umi. Let's try this. All right, we have we have our shield break in Lyra. We have Umi which is a DPS that does skill damage. And then we have a skill buffer in terms of Claudia. Wait, we're, we're back to fucking single element gameplay. But okay. Let's see how this works. Uh. Sure. I missed. Wow. Good job. I have to charge my magic time. All right, let's do shatter. Shatter Doko.
Holy fucking damn it. How does Umi work? Does she still do the card thing? I guess? Magic time over. Shatter? I mean, sure. Uh, sure. Sure. Oh, no. We'll keep going. Players have 30% increased healing. Every 10 seconds, the mobs will do 300% attack damage to players. And then the mobs have significantly increased resistance to crit. Oh god, what the fuck is this? I'm dying. Are we stuck on this floor? Damage Doko? Heal? Bro, what the fuck is this? Where's my damage? Alright, we're dead. Uh, what? Damage heal? Where? Why do I- why am I down to 1700 physical attack? Okay, none of these matrices are level, that's why. Okay. Right, when we cooked a... Uh... But we still cleared the other one. I guess that's when we cooked it with the correct fucking setup. We did good damage, but like... <laughs> Uh, hold on. Valio 145 right. has been upgrading their fence for five months. Just revamp current version. Buff old weapons and keep future power creep 1 to 2%. Give people a sense of progression. Yeah, that makes sense. But, you know, it's Hopper. Is Hoppa we're talking about here? This loadout. Should be good enough.
right? It's, it's especially like, look at this piece. Each one of these is like 300 something attack, like just leveling them up. Like you get so much stats from just leveling shit up. Like leveling things up, I guess your is your main progress for Toph reboot. Because like current version of Toph levels don't fucking matter at all. It actually mattered at the start? You just forgot? No, it doesn't. I mean, at the beginning of top, yes, it mattered. But like, if you're a new player today, none of the shit matters. Not really, at least. You just speed run to gold gear. And then the amount of stats from gold gear is sufficient enough. And you don't even need matrices or anything. Like, none of the stats from... None of the stats from any of this shit matters. Umi is level zero, okay. And then you have to level up gear. Yeah, to level up gear, you have to level up world level. To level up, to use better gear, you need a higher level. It's just like. Let's get Umi six. Is Brevi out? Brevi's almost bench already. What do you mean? Is Brevi out? Not on global yet, though. Right, let's see this. We're a uh, full 80 team, 4,400 stats. Let's let's try that. Let's try that thing one more time. Oh, there's our 300 DC for clearing floor five. Holy shit! Each floor has rewards now. Look at this. Every floor. I still think we're not gonna do shit, but uh Hey, at least we're doing some sort of damage right now. Okay, time for Umi to go ham. Oh, 
Huh? Oh shit. I have to do mechanics. Oh god. Shatter, please? I didn't get the shatter. Alright, rip me. Wait, I'm not dead. Where's the Umi skill damage part? He keeps eye framing me, man, this motherfucker. I can't clear. Do I have to read on how to play Umi now? I can't unga bunga. Hold on. Alright, let's see. Because they say Umi is a skill damage DPS. How? Uh... Skill? One eighty four point five for three seconds. I mean, okay, I mean, it's that skill damage. Lego Fortnite is fun. Wait, what? I missed a lot of card attacks as Nayan moved away. I don't think Umi is the, is the, because Nayan keeps moving, right? I don't think she is. I don't think Umi is it. A anyone else with skill damage? Cobalt is the other one. I guess it's only Cobalt. Let's try Cobalt. I have to go level her up. It's like Minecraft and Fortnite. But with Legos. The fuck Lego is making games now? Try the red card I tried. It wasn't that good. 
Give me my stats. Alright, we're gonna try this, but Cobalt. Do we keep leveling our gear? Hmm. I guess boots. We need two of these. How? Shop? It's not even in the shop. What the fuck? Nahano underscores it. Oh my god. Upgrading their fence for 15 months. Let go less than three seven eighths, 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 seven eighths. Elemental resonance don't matter, okay, YouTube chatter. Seven eighths, 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 seven Seven eighths, 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 seven eighths. Do I actually have to do mechanics? Seven eighths, 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 seven eighths. Why the fuck are you teleporting? supposed to do the parry thing. This 
This is closer? If I did mechanics, you would probably be dead. Oh god. Cobalt matrices level zero? Uh maybe. They are fuck. Uh okay. That was an easy clear. Isn't Cobalt Matrices about charge attacking? You're right. Let's try it. There's like, you gotta hold the charge attack for a thousand damage. Okay, let's do that. That's why I felt a bit off. We need to change our Cobalt gameplay. You still gotta do a dash attack after applying burn for Ionic Scorch and shit, but then you gotta actually add in a fucking uh, hold attack now, I think. Let's try again. They sent resources late so you couldn't level everything up? Yeah, I don't know. They just sent resources today. It's kind of weird. Where's my matrices proc? I guess it don't exist. Fuck. The hold attack doesn't seem to work. Where's my fucking... It don't exist no more? I was targeted. I guess, uh... I missed the shatter somehow. Thank <laughs> you. 
fuck? Where did she... The fact that she runs away is so annoying. And then, I do a parry and sometimes I don't fucking work. God damn it, that was close. What's the purple bar? If you do five parries, you'll clear it. Do I do I try and play parry game? Like you have to do your shit and then get ready for the dodge attack. And then like there was one dodge attack where I did it. I played the animation, but she somehow still dodged. So I'm like confused as fuck right now. <laughs> Maybe I need to change my relic, hold on. Actually... And the matrices aren't proccing. It's just not. Let me, let me read the matrices, what the fuck is going on with the... Right? It's just like 1,050 when your charge attack is. Is it the hold attack? It don't work. Oh, there we go. I saw a 1400 something multiplier. I guess it works. There we go. There's like a 14, 14,000 every 18 seconds. It's kind of. It's the delayed explosion? No, it's not. There is no delayed explosion anymore. That shit don't work either. There we go, that's a... Uh, 17,000 right there, okay. Maybe we have to cook a better relics. What other relics do damage? Cause th this shit is still not as good. Let's see. Actually, you know what? It's not bad. Now, Tsubozo is a basic attack damage buffer. Claudia is a skill damage buffer. Do we have to put Storm now? Okay, so I have to do basic attacks on Claudia for 10 stacks, and then I have a 45 second skill buff. Okay. This is what I gotta do.
And then we use, I don't know, Pepega Storm plus... Fuck it, do this. We're just gonna do this. Surely that works. Alright, 10 stacks. Steal damage buff. And she ran away. Nice. Refresh my steel damage buff. Refresh my steel damage buff. Oh god, fuck you. I don't get the fucking blueberry. It never fucking works. This is fucking garbage. The second one was late. Ah, fuck. This is clearable. I have to like actually dodge parry and do a bunch of try hard bullshit to even and then this relic is trash let's try another one bench lyra i would die if i bench lyra cube Cube is fucking useless. We try this. Maybe this will do something. Thank <laughs> you. 
See, the second dash parry, I did it on time, it didn't work either. Damage buff. Ah, oh, fuck you. You're dead anyway. <laughs> we cleared, holy fuck. I actually have to like try harder, what the shit? Okay. Next. It feels like PvP with another player. I mean... Very casual gameplay, okay? Very fun. Very fun casual gameplay. Weak to Vault. Weak to uh, resist crit. You have a 40 second, 40% reduction on uh, Fantasia. So Fantasia cooldown is 25 seconds in here. So it's 40% shorter Fantasia's cooldown. 40% more charge. They have 30% attack. When they get crit, they will take 100% more damage. I mean, they're forcing us to cook crow. Or do we Shiro guaranteed crit? I don't even know. What is this floor? Okay, let's try cooking crow. Crow is a basic attack DPS. Okay. Uh Where is our basic attack buffer? Subozo is the basic attack buffer. Okay. And then, uh, what else? What are, what are we missing here? We're missing Shatter. What did they cook Tion into? So Tian is a uh, is strong against Vault of DPS. They do thirty five percent less Vault of damage. Yeah. 
Tion gives its himself 30, 33% max HP for 35 seconds. Uh, and at the same time, taunts nearby monsters for 8 seconds. So Tion Discharge gives himself 33% max HP over cap and then taunts for 8 seconds. And then the skill is a 35% damage debuff to vault targets. Vault damage debuff. Uh, basic attack passive. So every five basic attack hits will charge the weapon up to three charges max. Five hits per charge, three charges max. And then using any other weapon to do dash attacks or keep using Tion will do 60% AOE vault damage. And at the same time, give yourself 6% give yourself max HP shield for 3.5 seconds. Whoops, timed out. All right, let's keep reading. Hold on. I need to level up the weapons anyway. What else does he do? Ground combo, nothing else. Nor Everything else is normal, right? And then every time you charge, what each stack of charge gives you 5.5% max HP, 10% more healing increase up to four stacks if you don't charge him up for 25 seconds you'll lose a stack uh if you have full stacks of charge you will gain uh increased hyper body values and apparently the amount of hyper body scales with your your character level. The fuck? You can go up to six stacks. Hold up, where's. Wait, I don't see anywhere where it says this. Oh, okay, this is, it enhances this one. Okay, it's the same superconductor. Your superconductor can go to six stacks now. A1 is four stacks. And then when you go into combat, you immediately get four stacks of superconductor. And then we'll allow Tion to have 20% better shatter. And then at five star, Tion gets additional damage. 1.2% damage increase per stack of superconductor. 7 this is what? 6 stacks? 7.2 damage increase? What <laughs> is fucking useless? And then if you equip Tion, doesn't have to be active. Every time your HP drops below 20%, You'll trigger this effect. You will remove all your max HP buffing effects. Uh, limited only to Tion's own self buffs. And then you'll get a similar level. Shield instead times 42 percent so i guess all your additional max hp that you got will be 42 percent of it will turn into a shield 
when you're about to die at 20%. And then you'll get the shield for 30 seconds. And then during this whole duration, you have hyper body and there's a two minute cooldown. Right? This A6 basically just saves you. And then the the matrices deal damage based off of your HP, 2.3% of your max HP for 5 seconds. And then it heals you. The matrices heal you and increases shatter. Fucking weird, man. So Tion no longer kills himself and has good survivability. What is this? Toph 2 will fix power creep. Toph 3 will fix UI. Toph 4 will fix story. And they keep fixing something every two years. And then finally at the 10 year mark after they fix the entire game. And it's actually good. They EOS and pull the plug. Hey that kind of makes sense. Wow. Wow. Holy shit. We have a 10 year plan now. <laughs> 10 year plan till EOS. Seems good. Seems fucking good. Holy shit. How are we 745 achievement? We're rank 4 on this server. The fuck? <laughs> what the fuck were you doing? <laughs> and we got another mushroom. You've been actually grinding the server. That's crazy. <laughs> We got a shroom. See, there's still leaderboards here, okay? So we have uh, Momo here with 909 achievement. We're technically rank three on this account. Holy shit. You grinded achievements for five hours. Why? Oh god, alright, we're gonna we're gonna grind this bygone leaderboard. Oh we get one upgrade mat. I'm rank seven so far. I thought they said they were gonna remove the leaderboard. Wait, a gate to Dolko. Mob is on floor 15 already. I thought we finally caught up to mob, but I guess not. Cause like yesterday. Yesterday, Mob was stuck on floor 9. Momo was still stuck on floor 9. Today, after they gave us uh, all these gear level up mats. Uh, see, now that we got stats, a lot of people are clearing. Uh 
That's a level of everything. This is whale gameplay now, apparently. I guess the main barrier of progression now in Tov 2 is XP, at least like level of mats. So far, it's, this seems to be what it is. Mob has all purple gear. You just gotta actually grind joint ops. I guess. Or grind runes. Runes is what gives you these. You get this shit from runes. And then you can buy purple gear with it. Or field energy? I I think the field that we're not supposed to be able to gain access to this new area. But here we are. Fixed tab targeting, like the fuck is this camera? I still don't do damage. Why is this why is this bad? We're damaged. We are applying all the damage buff. Hmm. Fuck this, man. Back to this gameplay. Is this leveled? Fuck. It's not. We'll see if this works.
Why does this still do better damage? Did they overcook Cobalt? Why don't I use Rift? What does Rift do? Rift does nothing. Is Cobalt actually strong? Cause like I saw everybody using this this setup. Okay. That's this actually works. I just need to like level it up. Them stats. Wait, hold on. Let's see the ge the how much the gear makes in terms of difference in stats. Let's go inspect mob. Why wow, we have mimic requests and test over now? Uh, where's mob? Mob is cooking with 4,000 attack. Purple gear? I guess we can't see. There's no more gray space specific gears now. I think they cooked it to beasts, humans, and mechs. Those are three, uh, three things. Beasts as in like monsters. So are gray space mechs or monsters? Cause I don't, it don't fucking matter. Who, who cares? Who the fuck cares? And then King is no longer a backstage weapon. The discharge expires the moment you go to backstage, apparently. Targeting is still ass. Oh, 
Still no damage. The fuck is going on? Why do I do less damage in the last round? Like, what is going on? Can someone please explain? A bad grouping? Like, these guys don't group. Do we try to rip? I mean, we can try a rip. I mean, at least the three mobs aren't spawned at the three corners of the fucking map. They actually start off in front now. That's not working at all. They don't group. It says suck in targets for 10 seconds. Shit is not moving. Like, my one concern with stuff like this is it's still a gotcha, right? And I doubt that they're gonna just give all these fucking weapons to you for free. So, like, if you need a certain weapon to do certain... to clear certain floors... How the fuck are you... They expect players to have all weapons or some shit? No, and then also, the new servers are supposed to launch at the same time with 3.6, like... Are, are, is everyone just... everything is in standard? I don't know how they're gonna cook monetization. That doesn't make any fucking sense.
Everyone doom posting world channel. Everyone be like, I have full build. I still don't do any damage. Okay. We log in. Can't even clear the first fucking rune. And then we quit. How is this casual? This isn't the casual gameplay. The grouping is non existent whatsoever. This is like. This is some bullshit, man. Like, how do you group them? Let's see if Ruby groups. Ruby does group, right? Ruby does work. Hold on, maybe Ruby is the, the savior here. Ruby Cobalt King? What is this? This better fucking work. We're like hard stuck on floor nine of what the shit. I'm standing in the middle, that's why they're separating. I know, it's just like, you King, you have to stand in the middle, otherwise your skills don't fucking hit. You have to like, God, this is so stupid. Wait, hologram projector is deleted. I just realized, that's, no, that's not a thing anymore. Okay then. Group Doko? Suck? Where's the Ruby suck? 
<laughs> it don't exist. Nope. It only taunts. Now what? Anything else? King is supposed to have group. King hold attack or whatever the fuck. Or dash attack. I remember, I forgot which one. Right? Attack, 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 hold. Right? Dash attack is supposed to hold. It, do it doesn't, though. It doesn't. Does Dion still suck? Tiahan doesn't work either? We'll find out. We'll find out. How's Plotty day two? I don't know. Let me check if she got updated. I don't think so. There's PvP in chat right now.
focus on you. Oh shit. Rumi sucks. Kind of. I gotta I gotta properly group them together first. But Umi does suck. I saw the mob jump over. But like, are these mobs fucking are ranged, so like, how the hell do I have to like... There we go. It's still not enough. Umi hold attack sucks too. Wait a second. Wait a fucking second, really? Damn, Umi has forced suck? Holy shit! It's kind of hard to use. Oh my god. It's it The grouping is still copium though. This is going live apparently immediately and it's so undercooked. Everything does no damage. I guess I have to get my gear up, but then they didn't give us enough gear mats, right? They didn't give a shit. We have to go farm for purple gear? Mob is on floor 18 now. We actually gotta go get gear. 
how. Match for this bullshit? Let's, let's try a match. No one's queuing, right? Wait, they gave stamina pots? Oh, there's one stamina pot. And it expires on the 25th. So it's a two week stamina pot. Yikes. Oh, you bought them from the shop? Oh, there's a daily purchase limit. Okay, okay, okay. Bruh. What can you get from this? Cope garbage. Wait, there's a selector. There's a selector banner. Hey, yo. Is the flame gold shared? I think it is. Is it? Let's do a test. Okay, let's pull on uh, one pull on Lyra banner. And we get one flame gold here. We got jack shit, obviously. And then... What the fuck does this even mean? What the fuck does this even mean? It goes to zero, back to one. Uh. I think it's shared. It's the same flame gold. Okay. Wait, did they somehow manage to change the pity mechanism? Let's see, let's read this one more time. Wait. Fuck is this? What the fuck is this? They changed the fucking... They changed the gotcha. You have a wish list now. Where? How do you add? Wait, what? Huh? Wait. What? Where? How? I don't think it's. They, they changed the gotcha. They, they changed the gotcha, but I don't see where you can choose. Yeah, cause like you have this, uh, the description, the description here says, uh, the drop rate is the same as you, as live 2% overall drop rate. Every 80 times you're guaranteed, All right? Uh, pity doesn't, pity does carry over, blah, blah, blah. This is a usual shit, right? But
But this line, it says when you get an SSR weapon, there's 50% chance that it will be Lyra, right? And then you have a 25% chance for it to be uh, uh, Wu Qi Mao Ding. Okay. Uh, the, the, so this is like some sort of. I don't know what this is. It says there's a 25% chance to get a weapon from this. Right? All, all available weapons that are in this. And this is usually means like uh, you select a few weapons. Or this will be another, another thing where... Right? Because th this is your... Bruh. This is a wish list, basically, I think. There's 25% chance for it to be a weapon in your wish list. And the other 25% chance, it'll be for uh, everything that's in standard. Okay, so 50-50, you get the actual weapon. And then the other 50% is 50-50 between uh, selected shit or standard. It says standard, but like... This is standard, right? It didn't say original standard. Let me let me take a screenshot of this. This is kind of important. Uh, and then everything else is the same. And then. This description didn't change. Wait, this is part of the pool. Wait a second. Does it mean like... 25% chance to get this other stuff? Right? Twenty-five percent chance. This, if you literally translate this, it says weapon lock. But then, here duplicates. It says we'll give you flame gold candle drop, like Lyra specific flame gold. So like, I'm confused. What the fuck? Why is it still shared? Maybe this is like half cooked, half cooked bullshit. They might still be changing things, but like, so far they changed the gotcha mechanics. Slightly. <laughs> I like how the UI is different. This shop UI, and then this shop UI, the fucking text is different. This is just an overlaid text. This as well, but like the fucking font is different. Uh. Let's check the matrices description. All right, maybe this also changed. Same shit. Matrices is also 50-50 and then 50-50 again when you lose. K 
candle a drop? <laughs> Wait, I just noticed. <laughs> it's so good. And then there's no English on Tian. Oh, this says flame reaction. This just says Umi. Ruby says weapon. <laughs> okay. Frig says angel. Asaki Fuwa. Bro, these UI artists, man. <laughs> no consistency whatsoever. <laughs> P. Coppa. This is P. Coppa moment. They could have put candle here and drop here and it would make so much more sense. But they did. Le drop canned. So bad. <sighs> okay. Let me screenshot this. And then let's see what the difference is compared to live. All right, let's go to live. I need to I need to check this. I could have just swapped my account, but okay, my bad. I mean, I mean, let's check if there's an update for Plotty. No, still no update. <laughs> like, why the fuck you give us patch notes, but don't fu and give us maintenance time, but don't actually put it into the fucking test server. Bruh. They said there's going to be a maintenance at 5 p.m., which is like four hours ago. The maintenance never happened. Yep, they have enough manpower for real, for real. Wait, I don't have access to this, my bad. They forgot. Like, they keep telling us shit, but they're like... We don't see. How, like, how, how are they making us believe them? If they don't do any of this... Like... How do they expect us to believe them? <laughs> All right, let's 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 see. Uh This multiplier right here is still 3200. They said they nerfed this to 2000, so it is not updated. Too busy with reboot? They're not. They haven't updated the reboot server or provided the reboot group a single announcement ever since the fucking reboot servers went live. Does Plotty heal? Uh, yes. At A5. And this shit's expected to go live on the 14th. In three days, guys.
All right, let's see the gotcha here. Gotcha page over here. They they did an event page, which just added more doom posing. Uh, so the gotcha description here. Yeah, there we go. The description changed for sure. So, uh, when you get an SSR, 50% chance for it to be her weapon. There's no 25% chance of bullshit. Okay. Is Plotty main DPS? Yes. Yeah. So now what? What are we testing? There's nothing to test. Reboot server has no changes. Plotty test servers has no changes. DPS testing? They didn't give us their changes. How do we test DPS? We're going to support the game for 10 years to come. We have plenty of manpower. We can't even manage two, two separate test servers. Like, you know what? I'm like mega confused right now. They said 10 years of support, not good support. What did we cook to be really good last time? This? I guess it was this. What do you think of Lottie? She's like one of the more fun characters to play, honestly. Really good character design. Kid is okay. To the, your typical power creep. She was way, she's way more interesting character to play than, uh, than Brevi, that's for sure. wanted to swap weapons like why was I not able to swap weapons Fiona Faisa is very good why the fuck are you using Fiona in here it 
Is it bug? The reboot is officially launching with 3.6, yes. The reboot server is launching in three days, chat. That's gonna be great. Trust Hopper. Damage at all Why am I not getting any damage? Did mob fuck up my gear or something? Like... This don't really make sense. I have her tray, right? This is her tray, right? Yeah, there, this is her tray. I am also on flame. I am using the right things. I am playing the right weapons. This shit was broken on Cactus. I, I guess it's not broken. It's just like damage calc was fucked. Cause like. This is not good. And this is floor 51. I should be able to clear with whatever the fuck I want. This is terrible. The fuck happened? Post was deleted. React to what? Who deleted that shit? What is this? Retracement server is barely finished and is far from launch. That's fake news. It's launching in three days. What do you mean far? Deleted by the person who originally posted it. Is, are you a viewer? You wish it launches together with 3.6 CN. Already has event baked. Meant for old players to invite new players. What? What is this? Who the fuck shipped my video on Gotcha Gaming? Huh? Cockroach game still didn't die. <laughs> TLDR, I'm not watching this guy. 
Blah, 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 blah. Uh... Still can't believe the game hasn't shut down yet. What's this? No transfer. I will try this if it's coming to global. Uh... What's this? Looks good for a first test. Yeah. This is the first and only test. It's shipping live in three days, okay? Looks promising. There's a lot of ifs. Gets downvoted to oblivion, okay? Pinged you with the original post of the dude that deleted real quick? Wait, what? Oh, you put you posted on disc. Okay, I had a cafe. Uh... Hold on. See this cafe. Okay, what's this? So why the heck do a lot of people act like it's going online tomorrow? Oh, it's posted by Hollow Breaker. Okay, understandable now. It's posted by Hollow Breaker. Uh, like this one, in a nutshell, it's not even finished, but you can't wait to sentence its death. Off to a nutshell. Fix the game, fix old characters, add game modes. This is brilliant. <laughs> Restart by this about to get people to respend. <laughs> what is this? You are literally bringing anxiety upon yourselves and you refuse to admit it. Whatever me and Koro told you, the retracement server is still not top to or reboot. It's not. Okay, sure. You also think retracement server will definitely draw players away from the old servers. Well, according to CM players who are in the retracement test server, they all say it's it's more like Dark Soul mode instead of Genshin mode you imagined. I mean, sure. It 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 kind of is, but like That's why we're confused as fuck. Is barely finished, far from launch. I wonder why he deleted his post. Wait, is this guy, did this guy delete his account? Or is, what happened? What happened? Hollow Breaker. People? A oh, guy's still alive. Okay. Doom posting time. Wait. Dude is alive. Check this, what's this? What is this? Huh? 
Huh? This is all the deleted pose by him? Wait, what? <laughs> no, it's people- No, it's usually mods that delete his shit. Like, for example, this pose. What is this? I have no idea what the fuck this is. I'm not gonna bother using this. I'm not gonna bother using this. But yeah, this guy hasn't been a hasn't been alive for the past like three months. He shows up again suddenly. My like, last post was like two months ago. And then it has a subreddit called Attack on Hoyo Simps. Fanta Fanta. Fanta Fanta tweets. Fanta Fanta tweets. <laughs> What's up with Fanta Fanta? Is he still alive? Whatever, man. This is the biggest problem. Biggest problem right now is the fact that this shit is going live in three days and... It's gonna be 1.0 all over again because it's undercooked bullshit all over. They, they debate everyone that was hyped for returning to the game just to disappoint them all again. And, uh... Right, think about it this way, right? You... You bait people... Back to your game, the people that are willing to give you a second chance because you promised... All the fucking casual game modes. How everything is balanced. And then they log into the game and it's the exact same bullshit all over again. Cause that's what I feel, it's literally 1.0 experience. It's literally 1.0. Nothing has changed. In the in the casual player perspective, not a single fucking thing has changed. Right? Like their their marketing is towards Genshin players to return. The actual game shift is some try hard fucking MMO bullshit and It don't even make any sense. So like, I'm hella confused. I'm hella confused right now. But, uh... Shit. Do devs even care about global people? I don't know. Surely they do. I don't know, the only way... <laughs> no, I, I, I still don't think Hoppa can be saved. Like, the game is gonna keep running for the next 10 years. For, like, everyone's gonna forget that the reboot servers ever happened, and then it is what it is. Like, I, I don't know what they're doing. Where the fuck is the update for Plotty? 
That's what I'm here for. Can you fucking update the test server, please? What's the fucking point of testing? What's the fucking point? When you don't ship the patch. They always do this now. Like they keep the servers on forever and then they, they give us patches mid midway through tests. Whenever they feel like it. What is this? The fuck is this? This is a Huawei Honor, whatever the shit. And then you get an acrylic. Huawei Honor 100. What the fuck is this? Anything on Billy Billy? Right, my, my only concern with the reboot servers right now, right, because when we started playing, uh, there was no time gates and everything, right? And then, but like, level cap yesterday was 41. Now it's 42 today, after a day. So like, okay, that's a new loading screen. Okay, Pog. Like, The whole fucking thing with the reboot is the servers are should have been active, right? Those are not fresh servers. So I'm I'm pretty fucking sure all the supply pod time gates are still there. Because the time gating follows the server, the server time. And the only reason why the server is level 40 something or whatever is because this reboot server has been cooking ever since the content creators originally posted their videos. It's the same servers that's been kept alive and not a fresh one. That's why we're on level 42 cap. And you got 400% XP boost to catch up, right? I mean, yeah, do, do you get a 400% XP boost to catch up? on day one, right? That's not how it works. No, like they want feedback from the players. Their whole goal is to collect more feedback from the testing so they can still make changes to stuff. But like, that's what they say. And then they come out with a fucking event. They come out with this shit. Two year anniversary event. To get new players to play the reboot servers. 
So like it's confirmed it's gonna ship live unless they cancel everything. Which at this point I don't think is happening. They cook us fireworks to, to, to celebrate EOS, I guess. In Plotty's kit. <laughs> Think about it. Fuck firework items. Pull the new character for fireworks, okay? Like, I, I don't understand what the fuck they're cooking. Yeah, she drops cosmetic fireworks for, for whatever reason. And there's like 20 million designs. I'm still seeing new ones after spamming this shit. You said since day one all these things not gonna work it's not about working or not like they come out with all these announcements feedback collecting feedback like you thought they finally realized what the fuck they're doing wrong and then they like cook <laughs> bullshit that's the same exact problem that's what's really disappointing with this entire fucking reboot server shit You thought they changed part 10. They're still clueless as always. That's a new one. I've never seen that before. Well, I guess I'm dead. Goodbye. No, it's like we we were thinking about Genshin with their announcement, but like look at look at their fucking original announcement. Just fucking look at their original announcement. Okay. Let me refresh this page. Let me let me see what people are saying. People still dooming on reboot. Uh, let's see. Where is their original announcement? Like, they know what we want. Like, this is the thing, right? They'll be like, okay, we know what the players want now after playing and uh, going through the two years with the players. That's why we're going to create a brand new servers to bring back the other players and not with the the two the two year players that have stuck around with you. And then uh, they've decided to operate this game in the long term. The purpose of reboot. Uh... 
right? They want us to have fun with exploration. Okay. Right? To make exploration feel better. Okay. And then we'll we we want to remake what open world an open world game should look like. Okay, to be immersed in the open world exploration culture. Okay. Yes, they did they did delete a bunch of shit. Right? They also want to simplify dailies. Make dailies easier. Okay. Don't want you to spend out 100 hours in Tov. They want you they want to make your time worth it. And then they cook like extra fucking hard join ups where you take an hour to clear. Uh not like not nothing nothing changed here. The exploration is still the fucking same. Okay. Uh Right, and then there, there's like this game will have a very steep like the current TOF has a very steep learning curve, right? They wanna which causes people to quit, and then they make the game even harder <laughs> to play. Like I'm what? People going out to search for guides, copy homework, like you can't unga bunga anymore. Like th what they say here. Makes you think that you can unga bunga the content. But instead, it got even harder. And then they said like, Okay, uh, if I didn't pull for X, then I can't play. Now it's, uh... Even if I have X, I can play. But in reality, they cooked. No matter what X you have, you can't play. It's like, what? I don't know. The fucking content is way too hard for the fucking audience. They, they're trying to... They're trying to get back here right a huge learning curve they want to simplify the game and then the game wasn't simplified instead it got harder and nothing works anymore like I don't fucking know and this is shipping in three days more like two days cause we're Uh Right and then they talked about like how players were happy to unlock hidden side quests and then starting to like certain characters blah 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 they cooked nothing with regards to story nothing at all Like, I'm so confused. Like, this is not finished.
Right? And they're like, we have plenty of manpower. The new reboot server has their own team. Their own team that doesn't fucking update the test group whatsoever since it started. For It's been over a day now. Right? This new team has done nothing. Uh, and then will not affect the live server and uh, optimization for the live server. And then the live test server was affected immediately. They said they were going to maintain the fucking update the client. And then it's been four hours. There's still no patch. So... Like, what? what? They keep saying all this shit, but like nothing, they're not showing any of it. There's, I don't know what they're doing at this point. Are you sure the event is for reboot release and not just reboot test server? Bro, look at this event. Just, just look at the fucking event. It's a test event page, yes. The event is titled for 3.6. It has two year anniversary cooked in. It says back testing server. It, it's not back testing server is the name for reboot server. No, they're not. And then what do you get? Two red, four red pulled. It's not called back testing server. Okay. Uh. So this is an event page. This is the event page for the live. This is a live version, live server event page. Hold on one sec. Okay, so this is the live version, right? This is a separate event page, right? This is for old players to invite new players to the reboot okay this is a separate page papa's special party apparently this is some whatever the fuck this is and then you get ssr relic shards No, 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 no. This is the this is the live version, right? This this is the event page for people to invite old players and new players to the current live servers. And then the other page that we saw, if you go back to the VODs, is specifically designed for the reboot server. So like they're telling old players that are currently playing
or are choosing to play the reboot server to invite other people to come play reboot server. Like the event page is different. Right? Same thing, uh, the event will go live December 14th. Uh, <sighs> this is a different event page. Hey, holy. Yeah, they said if the reboot server has good, some good cooking, it might be applied without messing with the balance to the live servers. But like. Perfect World is a huge, experienced company. <laughs> what? Yeah, sure. You think anyone else got the fucking update? Let me go check. I fucking doubt it. Where is Toph? Toph is almost on row three now. I mean, this is whatever they're cooking on the reboot server. Let's watch this guy climb, sure. Let's go, 
Y'all want to see Mob play my account? Where is Mob? I'm like super confused, man. Where the fuck is Mob? Where the fuck is Mob? Mob Dedge? All the way down here now? He's on my account now. Did I get kicked? Mob isn't even a flame man. I don't know what he's trying to cook. Oh, we'll see what the fuck happens, honestly. Fucking mob stream lag so bad. Fix your goddamn internet mob. What the hell are you doing? It wasn't lagging on the other guy. Let's see what this guy's doing. This guy's title is plotty test plus reboot test. And he's playing on the live servers. This this dude already stopped testing. Like he gave up. <laughs> There's no update. Uh when has this guy stopped playing test server ever? Uh look. None of the regular streamers are even testing anything at this point. Uh This guy's exploring. That will do on the live server. I don't know what this guy's doing. Clueless, clueless exploration. Uh, let's play Toph Global. Wait, what? We have a global player on Billy Billy. This looks like this looks like APAC. You appreciate the hard content, don't understand if this is a reboot or optimize at all. They call it a time retracement server, okay? That's the official name. Saying they're gonna fix all the problems. And like focus on the gameplay that players actually care about. Which, uh... I don't know, man. It did bring us back to 1.0 feeling where we can unga bunga play whatever weapon, but now let's play unga bunga play whatever weapon, nothing clears.
谢也会累，别忘了维护和保养。Guys, kind of struggling on floor 16 with maxed out gear and weapons, bro. They changed all the gear, like they the gear, the balancing, the weapon balancing is fine. Like everything was good. But like that's if that's all they cooked, it's not ready, but they're shipping already, so I don't know. I don't know what they want. It doesn't whatever they're doing don't make sense, okay? That's the alright, we're, we're like forget it. All right, they do whatever they want. Let's try it. Let's let me let's try and queue this. I lost faith. I had no faith from the beginning of the announcement, okay? I had no faith. No faith whatsoever. But I, like, this was even worse. I thought they would at least try a bit harder, but like, shit, I don't know what this is. Like, so, so basically, I thought, I thought this whole fucking reboot shit was actually going to be kind of alive. Right? And then it would kind of slowly EOS the main server. But then, like, this reboot shit is going to be... No, it's not going to be live whatsoever at all. This is even worse than what I thought. At least live servers are saved, right? Like, I really don't understand what they're doing. I guess we keep cooking bygone until... Like, if they actually cooked this for live, it would have been way better. Huh? 
because it's all all it is is a balancing change all the existing players are should be fine with this Right? Everyone on the reboot is like, what the fuck is this? Game is too hard. I I'm out. This whole reboot server is so tedious. <laughs> no one's even bothered testing anymore. Like, just, the test servers died this fast. It's gonna be the exact same shit on live. <laughs> Is this shit even designed for humans to play? Can't beat anything. I can't beat anything. That's a world chat, basically. Like... And they're trying to get the casual returners, the people that quit, because the game was too hard. Like, what the fuck, man? And then, didn't even give us XP? How the fuck do they expect us to test <laughs> join ops? And then new, new game modes are not even open. Yeah, if nobody... Is here for join up too, then we're just gonna... 
one chest and leave at this point. We're gonna have one more day of testing, okay? They're gonna miraculously fix all the UI, story, netcode tomorrow. And uh everything will everything will be fine, chat, okay? Inhale some good copium. I'ma just fucking just go. We're just gonna go. Let's see, two player. Two player. Do we just one chest this? Wow. I got some blue shit. Is mob coming? What is mob doing? Wait, mob or mob ended stream? Mob is still streaming. Apparently physical is good. We need something that's ranged. And physical damage. Like, what What am I supposed to use here? Because the, the fucking flying bitch. It 
Bai Ling. Let me upgrade my shit. Let me upgrade all my support shit as well because we might need it. It's like we can go in and swap because there's no like gear bullshit anymore. Uh, my Lyra is upgraded already. Sticks vid? There's a sticks vid? For what? What they changed the plotty? Absolutely nothing on the test server. They gave us patch notes, didn't actually patch. Let's see if we can actually find one. Is mob healing? Wait, mob can solo to the last one? What the fuck? Okay then. Alright, fuck it, we're just gonna go then. Tank still useless? We'll see, Mob says he can solo. Okay, let's see, let's see Mob solo. on numbers can we okay there we go sniping gameplay
Can we just do this? Is this the counter to this motherfucking? Mob is mob is supporting. I guess it is. <laughs> oh god. And these things are all in the fucking water. Oh, nice scuffed gameplay. Bruh, I can't even hit them. Uh -huh. Okay, fine. I guess we gotta switch to... I guess we gotta switch. The only thing that works right now is this. This is so scuff. God damn it, man. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Ooh, I got- I got helmet. I got a fucking helmet, chat. That's amazing. Get the chest under there? Oh, we'll do that later. Shattered, what the fuck? Oh my god, is this shit? Ice platform, Doko? Fuck! Oh my god. Help me. He's dead anyway, whatever. <laughs> there we go. We got a fucking helmet. We got a fucking helmet. Wait, you can't open the green one. You can't directly open the green. You have to open all the blue. Wow, okay. What do we get? Nope, nothing. Oh, the green one also gives you shit. 
Also, okay, so the green one is an extra reward now. Wait, did, did, did we auto-equip our helmet? Did that happen? Because I got a new helmet, it's not in my inventory. Wow, that's new. It's some piece of shit, though. But okay. I mean, I have a shit ton of XP mats. Fucking full send. Wait, I, I need... I need fucking world level. What? What? So how the fuck do I get... Like, I can't, I can't enhance my helmet. Oh, wait, no, I can. I guess you can't go excess? I got some lifesteal. Flame resistance. Nah, it won't let me. I can't go to four star. Apparently, you can only level your gear to three star. Purple can go to four star. You need to clear rune E1. Okay, I guess we have to we have to do rune gaming then. All right, let's go. Elemental resonance don't exist no more. I even have to kill them.
This fucking okay. Nice. This fucking throw bullshit is is still terrible. I'm gonna die. Bro. Fucking animations to stop! Like, I don't have to do all this bullshit mechanics. It's gonna be. All right. Can we like pre-heal this? All right, it's time. Wow. Ow. 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 Bruh. Nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Alright, Dark Souls mode. Fuck okay, it, let's go. I actually, have to, I actually have to hold a discharge. It's that bad. Ow? Ow? Bro. Bro, what the fuck? This is such bullshit. Stay the fuck away from me! Didn't manage to, uh, didn't manage to shield break. Now I'm fucking dead. Jesus Christ. Like, I used the discharge, I used the skill, I did some auto attacks. I'm still not, I'm still fucking dead. Nope. 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 Do I have to bring a healer? You can kill this with a uh, with pure skill, I guess. Can't escape from this shit. Nope, let's kill myself again. Hold on. What's food? I'm not using food. Hmm. Do we try, uh... I mean, clearly King didn't... Sh didn't shield break. Let's try Tion. Alright, Tion at least saves us. Let's see this. She some damage at the beginning.
Tion is supposed to uh do give us vault resistance or reduce his numbers. Fuck. Stop running. Wow. That didn't work. Uh... I'm shredding his vault damage. Supposedly. Supposedly that's how it works. We have to actually, like, have to heal. Unfortunately. This is kind of bad. Uh, you think Shiro is still broken as fuck and can delete shit? I mean, no, Shiro. I didn't level Shiro. <laughs> Never mind. So we need to save two discharges to break his goddamn fucking shield, I guess. All right, let's go. Full charges, motherfucker. Wow, that did no damage. Break shield. Lyra is supposed to be a shield break weapon. Like, hello? Where's my shatter? No, it don't exist. That's what it is. It don't fucking exist. Biz resist. But still.
God, fuck no. <laughs> Man, why has this got to be so hard? Resist effect shatter, I know. But still. That was so low. I did it without credit card power? What do you mean? This is full A6. Plus three star matrices maxed out. Think about it. Think about it. Did they unfix Crow Dive? CN Crow Dive has always been the same. I don't know what you're talking about. There's nothing to unfix for Crow Dive. All this for what? All this so we can buy a few more pieces of gear. All right, guys, we're going to buy a bracer. All right, 400. This is an upgrade. Surely it's an upgrade. Attack, damage, weakness. Let's go. Plus 72 GS. Can feed the old one. Fuck feeding the old one. We can go to three star. Ooh. Gains. All right. Uh, we can level up our world level now. Wait, I need level 45. I can't even do that. Never fucking mind. Never fucking mind. Uh, uh, what's the difference between... So damage is here. Whenever you do damage, you get, you get 39 extra attack. That's what it is. Right? Whenever you do weakness, whenever you attack weak, weakness targets... You do 24 extra. You have 24 extra attack. That's what it is. It's, it's not damage increase. You just get additional attack. When you're when you fulfill a requirement. Keep farming bygone, I guess. Like, I can't, I can't, I can't get better stats. This is it. Reboot server is also at 3.6, supposedly. Okay, supposedly it is. Because they already cooked, like, they already cooked the, the marketplace. It's just I didn't get the story to that point yet. All these shops are already cooked. All right, climb bygone. Let's go.
Do I have fun? I don't know. It feels like the same fucking thing to me. For me, at least, as an old player, it feels the fucking same. Does Lyra gather still? Oh, Lyra still gathers. Okay. Can I just do DPS Lyra? There's still no damage whatsoever here. Like, I still can't clear this. I don't know. You need a very specific comp to clear this. You can't unka bunga no more. This is 13 levels below current level, I know, right? Like, how? This don't even make sense. This is like maximum potential gear. You can't even... I can't even farm for anything else. Maxed out, 6 star. Maxed matrices. The fuck am I supposed to do now? Tsubozo fridge? Let's see. Tsubozo Fridge plus Shatter. And then this will... Tsubozo is a basic attack buffer, right? Lyra will be the Shatter, sure. Let's try this. No shatter whatsoever. Ding 
There's, there's like... What do they expect me to do? Group weather? Billy Billy has an update. Hold on. Really? Let's see. All right, 34 minutes ago, there's an update. Let's see, what the fuck are they gonna say? All right, uh, warning, warning, gravity reversal, brand new version 3.6, two year anniversary. Uh, events will open at the same time. Come participate in Tata's birthday party. Wanderers. Here, here's uh, what's what's coming. Okay, here's all the new shit. All right, all brand new map, Aquaville. Uh, prepare your anti dizziness. Apparently, there's some something that you can apply to your skin, so you're like. Anti-motion sickness when you're... Well, whatever, right? Use anti-motion sickness meds. Basically is what it says. Okay. And then on the 15th, we'll have Bloody. Uh, brand new events. Fenrir skin. Limited time accessories. Will be easily available. Uh, log in for 14 days. You'll get 10 red pulls, 10 special vouchers, selector banner, I mean selector weapon box, or 80... Or 80 black gold. Chat box, whatever the fuck, that's it. Right, did, did they say anything about reboot? It was basically new new map, new bosses, uh, new puzzles, blah blah blah. Okay, sure. Next, Plotty reruns. Sure. Two year anniversary events. I mean, we saw all this. P more PvP events, as usual. Uh, skin plus bike. Gachapon. Biochemical collapse. New thing that they cooked for. This will be on the 31st. This is an event that they cooked for the reboot server that will also be live. Uh, and then a recap of your player stats for two years. Uh, scroll. Login bonus. Double top of reset. Bundles. Uh, you can rebuy the selector and there's a new player supply bundle. That's it. Anything else? That's it. No nothing new. It was like expected shit that we all saw in the live stream. Wait, rerun banner is now. Hold on, real? Uh, 
Okay, the rerun banner allows you to... Okay, so it's basically got the global treatment. Rerun banner now gives you... Let's you pick whatever with your flame gold. It's not exclusive flame gold anymore for rerun. Basically, whatever global is cooking. But then... What the fuck? So this is live on the 14th to the 20th. All rerun. And then after the, all the, the rerun banner is over, uh, the physical and flame rerun is going to stay. Oh, and then the Fizz Flame... The Fizz Flame banner also shares Flame Gold. Okay. Okay, so, so finally, for Globe, for CN, we get the Global Flame Gold to sharing. After like two years, Jesus Christ. They got it first year? It's not shared Flame Gold, okay? CN has never had shared Flame Gold since before the two year anniversary. For us, this will just be for the anniversary. I mean, it says that they're shared, so if you pull on the physical rerun, you can also use it on the flame rerun. I think that's what it says. But like, you know, the, the or statement. It says, uh, physical rerun, you can exchange for physical rerun, ho is like, or, flame rerun. If you pull from the... I don't know, man. And then also the 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 way that they said this, right? Uh there is a chance if they did change the banner to they they could like because this also says molding, right? This also says weapon lock up. It says the same terms as in here. So there there could be a chance that this system got implemented. So, right, because this, this is not shared with the other banner still, but then there is a chance that if you lose your 50-50 on a selected character, you could get the other two. 25% chance. And then, uh... Oh, wait, no. There's a second line. On the 21st, Plotty Flame Gold. Uh, 
No. No, 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 no. What is this? No, 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 no. Let me reread this. Let me make sure I'm saying this right. Plotty banner and the rerun banner will add a new item. Okay. Yes. Okay. 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 So th this is a new feature that I'm not sure if it's going to be live or not. But basically, what it says is if you pulled on the plotty banner, uh, your extra flame gold, you can convert it to rerun flame gold. Or your rerun flame gold, they'll allow you to convert it back. So this is new. So your your current new banner plus rerun banner flame gold, there is a one to one conversion. And it also says the conversion both ways. But this is only this will only happen on the twenty first. Okay. But still, after the period ends, your flame gold is still going to expire, right? Pretty sure. Back to black gold. But during the during these banners, if you have extra flame gold, you can convert it to the other thing. You can complete your useless one piece lin on Nyan rerun. Maybe. Right? This this means that like if they do this, you're able to all your excess that you pulled on the live banner can be converted to any random matrices box. That's that's pretty good. Right? Hopefully this is a permanent thing. Cause C N before the anniversary has always been Okay, I tried to pull rerun Zeke. All the flame gold I get on rerun Zeke it goes to shit. I can't even ex exchange for Ganono. So if they keep this system, it's good for most people. It just doesn't fucking matter to me because I max everything anyway. They might port this to global. They should. Otherwise, Tencent's going to get some shit. As usual, if they don't. Every good CN feature we've pretty much gotten for global. Okay. And then some. So we'll see. But yeah, the selector banner, the selector box is still garbage. It goes all the way up to Saki. That's it. Right, and then basically, here, here's this, right? You get a free selector. Where's the event? The event page gave a free selector. Where is it? This is selector box three. I can't really check it because I think the paid selector gets up to date 
you get the newest uh you get all the newest weapons on the paid selector but then on the uh you also get a free selector standard uh the free selector can only still go up to saki I don't really see where the free selector news is. Wait, what is this? Oh, what in the fucking two year? <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Two year anniversary and they somehow is able to cook four different titles for players. So if you created your account in 2021 on CN, you get this title. If you created your account in 2022, you get this title. If you created your account in 2023, you get this title. And if you create your account in 2024, which is next year, you get this other title. There's four titles. Oh, I'm not showing, my bad. But it doesn't fucking matter, it's in Chinese. Like, how would you guys know what title? It don't matter. It don't fucking matter, okay? You guys don't have to know. It's in Chinese. Still show it? I mean... It's in fucking Chinese. How would you know? There's four different titles, basically, for each year. I'm not translating this. I mean, Tencent will localize the title anyway. Like, you, you guys aren't going to get the same ones. It don't matter. Whatever, man. <laughs> this guy's like the selector banner flame gold is all generic you can use anything holy shit and this clueless clueless comment clueless chatter trying to correct him nope not shared. Wow.
Everyone is surprised about a uh, shared flame gold. Oh right. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, forget this. Let's let's double check if they got a patch, and uh, if not, no, nope, still no patch. Nice, good job. Never fucking mind. Still no patch. All right, back to reading this shit. Can we find anything else? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Don't want to log in yet. So anniversary banner has shared flame gold. And then the rerun banners for Flame Fizz will open after that, and they all still have flame, shared Flame Gold. The problem here is if you pulled on Anniversary, your Flame Gold will not carry over to this. Pretty fucking sure. Bro, I got a full AFK Candy Crush lobby. That's crazy. Wait, what? Play Fortnite? God damn it, man. But why? Okay, also news. I forgot about this. This is a thing now. Uh, you can go to level 60 now and there is a uh, gold modules okay and then gold modules you can get apparently from events which by events we know Hoppa means gotchapon machines probably. And then uh also from raids. So far that's what it is. And then inside raids, heroic gets you these gold ones. Type three now. Challenge mode. Wait, hold on. Challenge mode gives you 10 more plus one extra. There's actually a huge difference between challenge and heroic. Nice. Get fucked. Get fucked casual. Even more. K110X has been upgrading their fence for 13 months. Torfios? Torfios? Close enough. Okay, maybe next year.
So micro reactor, everything else the same? Let me see. I think so. Everything else is the same. All they did is added uh they added extra gold stuff. Right, so 5-1 versus 15-2. So... And it's weekly time gated. So if you clear a challenge mode, you can click one time every week. I guess. Unless the event acquisition method is different. And then these like hard hard challenge raids are still the same. Wait, so that means... Wait. Does this mean if we didn't clear challenge raid? Wait, Sussy, did you clear raid on CN already? Did you guys clear the raid? This week? So if you guys clear, then get fucked. Yeah. Or, I mean, I don't need purple modules, so I don't give a fuck. Yeah. Yeah. So well, we're gonna try. We're, I'm a, I'm a wait then. Papa has been pretty consistent with no hoarding policy now. But we'll see what they do. Starscream, I have that clip. I saw it already. Make it happen? No, Hoppa? I, I can't even reach Hoppa. Like, how do, how do I make it happen? I think the better rotation wait a second I think you still have to do dash attack I'm just thinking about this Hold on. Hold on. So basically, remember when we cooked physical? And, uh... We were trying to... Like, you press skill. And then you did dash attack. Twice. And then you go yen meow. Right? What if you don't do that? Instead, you don't reset the cooldown. You reset at the beginning of your rotation. Did you see BB Sum's 2D de debut? What? Yes, kind of. Is she going to be a streamer now? Hold on. All right. So basically. Right, you do this. Hold on, I, I fucked up, hold on.
Uh, you basically start here, I guess. Hold on. Asian bunny? Didn't she get banned? What? Alright, let's do this. Uh... Start with this. Body discharge. Skill. Forget about the... Yeah, there we go. Alright, forget about the cooldown reset. It don't fucking matter. Back to this. And then... Huh? There we go. Right? Like, you can come- you can switch back to her, and then do your dash attack. And then get the cooldown reset immediately. So you- you don't end up in the fucking air. So you switch to her, you do two dash attacks and then press kill. But like, how fast can you cancel this shit, right? So... Right? You can instant cast the skill and just re like, it refreshes. You don't have to wait for it. Let's see. Let's cook a better rotation. I just like figured out this might actually work. Let's see. Let's see how fast we can cancel. It's already. Wait, no. That, that was not. That was too fast. That was too fast. But like the fucking cancel eats you away. Uh. What the fuck is speed? What the hell is speed doing? What? Do we jump cancel it? No. Jump canceling is. Oh no no no! I did because I didn't apply discharge. Hold on. We need to apply discharge first. Okay, we have this mirror thing. It's here. So skill, jump, Yemyo. That was too quick. Because they optimized the dash attack to be only one now. So like now you just like dash attack skill into Yemyo. Alright, do this bullshit. Oh, 
That's so quick. I think I can cook a better rotator. All right, let's try this. Okay, so refresh into this way. No, I didn't fucking. God damn it! Hold on. I don't know if Peso is bench or not because he's kind of scuffed. Bro, this fucking bubble shit is annoying as hell. Stop. Alright, let's go. You don't need dice. Dice is just a damage button. There's no dice involved in here. Okay, that's 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 pretty good. I ended up cooking almost 4k. 4k multiplier is like... Dice is being used for damage buff. It's the same shit as mask. Same shit as fucking bubble gun. Same shit is like... It's like a permanent buff up time. Why are y'all still fucking clueless? I've been trying to explain dice to you guys for the past fucking like... I don't know, whenever they stopped making dice relevant. And y'all still don't fucking get it. And you're still throwing. 
Calm the fuck down. How fucking clueless can you be? Can you cancel plotty skill by- Yes, that's what I'm doing. You switch weapons. You don't have to jump. But the skill will still put you in the fucking air. Which is the problem here, like... Right? You switch weapon, you're still in the fucking air. The, the skill fucking jumps you into the air. So I guess this is decently okay for Fizz. After they finish cooking and actually update the goddamn test servers. Where I can reset her skill with one dash attack. It'll be fine. Because it, it, it's not here yet. So expect 4k multipliers. Let's go check Cactus. Cactus should all be dead. Or do can we kill a Cactus? Apparently open world Cactus can be killed. Isn't there supposed to be a cactus here, or am I... Oh wait, no, you can't kill cactus anymore. I thought they fixed this. Yeah, yeah cactus got fixed. Supposedly. Because I didn't- I've never received an update on the test server. Maybe they did. Fuck is my charm? I'm confused now. How do you get Wait, what is this? Oh shit. The fucking thing that auto that auto collects field energy for you? If you didn't claim last week, it gets sent to mail. So like... It's a weekly thing, right? If you do this with a group of people... So if you find open world extractors with a group of people, there's a bonus. And then if you collect it after like a day... But if you don't collect it for the entire week... After a refresh, it'll get sent to mail. That's pretty interesting.
server-wide progress, I'm pretty sure. Because if you don't track, like you gotta track, right? We'll see. We'll see when it hits live. The toxic world of Genshin Impact. <laughs> what? And then also my dash attack is kind of scuffed. Super chat on YouTube? Does Restream not show me super chats? Huh? Because I don't see it. I actually can't see super chats. That's fucking weird. Cause I have this combined chat thing. Oh, it's called Super Sticker. I thought, what the fuck? Okay, never mind. Genshin is your rank two category on your Twitch annual recap. <laughs> I wonder why. Uh, Wow, my daily bit oiler turned into a super chat frog. YouTube frog. And then the test server auto attack chain is hella fucking scuffed. Like, th th this is... Yikes. It's like, just way slower than on live. I can't wait to go back to China and play it. Like, by the time I'm back in China, I can actually play dash attack comps for the, like, one month that I'm, th I'm there. Cause like I'm doing, like I'd say, 20% less DPS because this fucking dash attack animation is unplayable. <laughs> is the update here is not. Fucking ping based game, man. Fucking still can't optimize netcode after two years. Dash attack is somehow still ping dependent. Like, why? And then Nanyin. Full charge is not working. Why? No, I didn't have a problem in China. There was no problem. It was absolutely fine but when I was there.
I already worked with Tov when it came out and made a song about it. They slid me some money and in-game stuff. What? <laughs> the Tov rap song was paid? Was a paid actor? Where's my money for Tov content? The fuck, Tencent? Plotty assist is both damage. This is kind of weird. That is actually fucking weird. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Did we check sequential yet? Did they cook another sequential floor? <laughs> Seven brains. <laughs> hey, you're saved, Drinz. They added this feature. You'll be fine now. It'll never happen again after 3.6. Okay. It, it actually tells you that you're full. Unless you insta redeem, but like you can still redeem. So like if you redeemed straight up one piece to seven, you're still fucked. But like, <laughs> you know. You can still buy it, even if, even if you're full. Alright, did they cook a new sequential stage? Let's find out. Oh shit, there is floor 11 sequential. Wait a second. Wait a fucking second. Let's see what the boss is. Huh? Huh? What is this music? I'm not looking forward to this. Oh god. Oh fucking god. Don't do this to me. What the fuck is this? Wait, 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 wait. Who the fuck are you? I think this is a story a story spoiler. Bro This guy has Fantasia. He fantasias you. And if you have to trigger your own Fantasia to block his Fantasia. Apparently. Oh god. What the fuck? Let me kill him for him, and then we'll figure out what he does, because like, so far, this is easier than the other one. At least it's not Nayin and you get, like, randomly deleted out of nowhere. Oh, 
Okay, I killed him. All right, let's try again. Let's see what he does. Too, too much fucking effects. Let me turn down my effects. So now I have zero effects. And then we can uh, plotty analyze him too to see like his shit, I guess. Okay, so yeah, there is a physical resistance there, right there. This is some story dude, probably. Apparently this is an undead. Alright, let's try to anti-Fantasia him later. If I survive. I mean, Plotty does passive healing, so we're chilling. Hello? Fantasia me? Do I have to get him to a certain HP? Because he's not doing his Fantasia bullshit. Yeah, I think I I think I have to act with I didn't do it. Uh, wait, he puts. Wait, does he put your Fantasia on cooldown? That's kind of bullshit. Brevi for cleanse? You don't get that option. This is a physical sequential. Maybe on the Brevi floors, but I don't think, uh... Let's see. He doesn't... Like, he puts me on Fantasia. I can't even clear it. Do it again. So sorry. Like, how do I Fantasia him?
Plotty skill can Fantasia? True. But like that means we have to time our shit. Do we have to turn on swap Fantasia? Like it's so scuffed. I don't know where he's from. What are you, what are you supposed to do? But okay, that's the only mechanic that I see, though. Like the Fantasia is like two five seconds. You don't he doesn't even attack you during it. Like how do you fucking trigger Fantasia? To prevent it. It don't even make sense. Alright, let's hold a bloody skill. Sure. We'll hold the bloody skill to see what it does. And maybe cancel it out. See, this is the problem. By the time I get to my Fantasia, his already ended. It makes no fucking sense. So, like, I, t I don't get this mechanic at all. It's another, another one of those Hoppa undercooked mechanics. That they thought was cool, put it in and be like, done. Wait, I see a cactus tester. Does that mean we got the update? Man, what a what a what an awesome test session today. No changes whatsoever from yesterday, like... Wow. Amazing. Still no update. Is it true game will get a reboot? They're gonna make another server. Yes. Do we wait for day three? <laughs> Time to play CN. Fuck this. They're not- they're never updating this damn shit. Alright, we're gonna just play CN. It's been it's been a good six hours, all right, of no updates. Let me go to the bathroom.
Why is Hatha called Hoppa now? Because they like to eat pee pee. back you don't know how people are happy with a character's kit being locked behind stars i mean genshin did it clearly people love it Oh shit, the world chat people asking what the hell is going on with the reboot server. Alright, re respond with it's a piece of shit. See and finish this shit. What the fuck is TZH riding in with a fucking bird? Lego for wait, what the hell is Lego Fortnite? Why are you guys bringing it up all of a sudden? There's a Lego collab with Fortnite right now or something? Huh? What? Yeah. Yes, play it. fuck why what is this it's it, it i love legos let's play fortnite moment wow i have three shatter drugs where the fuck is my 3.5 attack drug like this fucking game fucking hates me man Do I have any Legos yet? I need to buy more. I stopped, like, I, I was building all the fucking modular buildings. 
up until like f five years ago, I think. I'm missing like four or five sets now. I still buy them, but I never have the time to build. You've seen some people say it's a better version on Minecraft? Wait, Lego Fortnite is a better Minecraft version. What? The fuck? What's the name of this character? Brevi. How is Fortnite and Minecraft related? I'm so confused at this point. At this point, I'm confused as fuck and I'm also interested. Bruh. It's a Lego game, nothing to do with Fortnite. What the f- Lego Fortnite video game. What? It's a new game? What is this? Ultimate Survival Crafting Adventure. Huh? What? What? What's this got to do with Fortnite? I'm so. <laughs> No, is it a new game or is it just another Fortnite version? Like, huh? it's a new game. Okay, it's a game mode. What the fuck is it? Chat's not giving me a correct answer. What the fuck is it supposed to be? I'm so confused right now. It's a game mode? It's a game mode. Inside Fortnite. Okay. Because what this makes me think it is, is that it's a fucking new game. Lego Fortnite video game. It's a new game inside Fortnite as a new mode. Okay, that makes way more sense. I thought they they launched like a standalone game where you have to re-download everything and be like... It's inside Fortnite. Okay, 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 okay. Sure, okay, that makes way more sense. So, so you're telling me, if I go to Twitch, and I go, uh, watch Fortnite, you can see the Lego mode. It's the same category. I play with my Lego. Okay, okay, okay. Because I was assuming it's a th another fucking Twitch category or whatever. I'm so confused, man. Alright, is Sassy, are you coming? If you're not, we're just gonna send. Where did Sassy go? It feels weird without Sassy in the party. Sassy dead? Okay, let's go. Oh shit, it's balance mode. Okay. Balance is flame. Okay, let's do that. 
You can't log in? Wait, what? Well, account free to play account ruined, Sassy. Time to reroll. Oh shit, a full English character name party. This fucking chat. has been upgrading their fence for 13 months. Splash with the 13? Today, Mr. Cake Plotch. What the fuck? I'm scared. What is that supposed to mean? True. True. Yes, whatever I said was true. Can we vote kick TZH? 
Why, why are you on support? Like, without Sussy carrying me, this fucking balance join up shit takes way too long. Why can't TZH just be a goddamn flame main? Bro, these Fortnite bots, man. Are these Fortnite bots, what, why? Why is Fortnite popular again out of nowhere? Always has been popular? I mean... It popped off for a bit. It stayed decently popular, but like... I thought it kinda died down. Like the last couple years. Miao Banner in Taiwan. Antonio? Like, I don't I don't really understand. You've been what, what's your watch streak now? Has it been a month yet? And you're still trying to post links? Like more? <laughs> Asmon's indie company, Mad Mushroom, will release Atomic Pic- Wait, what? Asmon has an indie game company? This won't be good. Asma's gonna react to all the fucking reviews that are talking shit about it. Free content. What is Atomic Picnic? What is this? Co-op roguelike shooter, what the fuck? It looks like a Toph clone, okay? I don't know, man. All right, we're done with our two runs. Everything like 
think about it this way, right? When Toph runs for 10 fucking years... Like, think, uh, just, let's just think about it. When Toph runs for 10 years and keeps making bullshit game modes, right? Everything will in turn be a Toph clone. Right? The, the, the Toph reboot server is going to attract all the new, younger generation to play the game as their first ever game. And then 10 years later, every fucking new game coming out will be a Toph clone. Right? Toph reboot will pop off, right? Right? <laughs> Crew box, what the fuck? Crew box? Oh sure, I have a crew box. You got into Crystal of Atlan Beta. Nice. Not gonna play betas unless bag. Still. It is what it is. We'll play shit when they're live. Play Asmon's game and get back. We have a lot of Crystal of Atlan beta players apparently. You think I can finally get my achievement for, for sequential? Rank 1 for 10 times? I have two more times. I'm not gonna make it again. This this guy is gonna fucking clear. Right? I don't I don't get this. Like immediately after the update, this dude is gonna clear everything and then I'm gonna lose my first week again. You got one extra key if I'm interested. Bruh. Am I interested? Your Twitch recap. Wait, uh, fine. Let me watch my Twitch recap. Let's see. Where do you get the Twitch recap thing? Alright, first time. Let's see it. Alright. My Twitch recap. See your recap. Okay. What is this? Choose your recap as a viewer, creator, community. Bro, I've done 357. Does this mean I've missed only a week of streams? What the shit is this? Uh, what in the? Hold on, the fucking lawnmower dude is out for my neighbor.
Does it count the 48 hour streams as one? I don't think so. I don't, I, I don't understand this. 2023 isn't over. Why do I have 357 streams? I think maybe every time I DC and I have to restart the stream, it counts as another one. I'm pretty sure what this this is what it is. Okay. 2.24 million hours watched. Five categories? I mean five ca I've streamed five categories. That don't even make sense. Like this recap is bullshit. Like, I've definitely streamed way more categories than this. My top stream reached 6.33 thousand viewers. Wait, wait, when? When did we get to 6k? Was it, wait, no, was it during anniversary? Did we ever get to this point? Was this top 3.0? It was during drops and for 3.0, maybe. Three point eight million chats sent. Top five categories. Toph, Genshin, Nikkei, Star Rail. Star Rail? I don't even fucking play Star Rail. What? What about Lies of P? Like, I played way more than these five categories. Bro. Top three tags. What the fuck? Why was Cactus used 12,000 12, times? So see how we have the same categories? Uh, okay. Best clip, 2K. 765 million channel points spent. Huh? What in the shit is this? Where do you find this? This is on the homepage. Yay! Okay. 35,000 new followers. Wow, only 35,000. Feels bad, man. Minus another 50k. You think if I refresh, this is gonna go to nine? Let's see. Let's try refreshing. Surely it's, it's live updated. Nope, it's not. It's not. What is TZH talking about? What is TCH talking about? Watch hours? Do you do you know what it means? Every user that watches an hour is a watch hour. Alright, whatever. We have sent 308 raids. 
been received 641. What the shit? Loudest fans in 2023. Wow. Ringo is still up here. Holy shit. What do you mean by loudest fans? The most amount of chats? Does Ringo even chat much? I guess it's a combination of like gift subs and chatting and all, all kinds of things, right? Cause like Mikasa is barely here and he's up here. Or are these sound alert players? I mean, the, the, the sussies up here, that doesn't make sense. I don't know what this is, okay? Does sussy ever even play sound alerts? I feel like this, basically, they just put like random bullshit into the page and be like, recap. Don't forget to stream your recap. Wait, what? No. All right, time to time to be a viewer. Time to watch the viewer recap, okay? Let's see. Holy shit, why is it in light mode? Couldn't get enough of these cats. Why are we in just chatting? Why do we why are we just chatting rank 2? I wonder why. Diablo Like I, I don't even use emotes okay I've used My own emotes like 10 times Okay I've sent 4.9 Thousand chats that's bullshit I don't even I, I don't ever fucking talk how We gifted 10 subs I'm porridge, okay. Chat sent as a mod. Mod actions taken. What? How do I? I'm a channel mod for five channels? Huh? Top Twitcher, category champion, majestic moderator. I don't even know what this means. Oh shit, we have a chat badge now. Most watched. I mean, I guess... Does Sherry go to just chatting? She doesn't, right? Why do I... I don't... Like, none of these people are in just chatting categories. I'm confused. Aswan maybe? I guess maybe Aswan when he's reacting. Wait, when, when Aswan reacts, he's in just chatting, right? Maybe that's why. Okay. Sure. What is this community recap? Stories views. Oh, this is for the entire entirety of Twitch. Okay, never mind. Okay. These emotes were a hit. Sure.
Okay, whatever. What, what, I, I, don't, I have no idea what the, all this is. Okay, whatever. Okay, I feel like this recap is bullshit. Like, some of, some of this shit is kind of... It don't make sense. Is this actually my top five categories? I don't think so. Let's go to another website. Let's, let's see this. Uh, games. Uh, year 2023. Okay, I guess this makes sense then. I mean, I guess. But why does it only say five? I, I streamed HSR. I, I was paid for five days of bag streams. Two hours per day. So I did 10 hours of HSR at the beginning. And then I took a bounty and I fucked it up. So I had to redo it again. Well, we pulled Kafka. So that was like at least 12 hours. And then I went a bit over time, I guess, for 20. It makes sense. So I did like 12 hours for bag for sure. And then the other eight hours was overtime. Yeah, it makes sense. Your 128 gig phone can handle Genshin, HSR, and Tov? Sure. Should be enough. It should be just enough, maybe. Is G game 80 gigs? Is it? I don't think so. It's 30 gigs installed on my phone. Toff is... Toff is 20 gigs. HSR is 12 gigs. That should be enough. Like 128 gig phone, you can fit those three plus additional some, some like system files. It should be should be good enough. I mean, I guess this makes sense. Sure. All right then. And what do they mean by top ten? Like. Does this mean I'm a top 10 Genshin Impact streamer? Like, why Why am I not in Eversol? No one fucking streams this. <laughs> I don't understand. Like, I don't understand some of these stats. I don't fucking understand. It says you watch my channel for 995 hours. Wow. What the fuck? Oh, well. It is what it is, okay? Good recap. Uh, are we doing anything else? It's 8 a.m. in the morning. Apparently, there's only five categories, I guess. <laughs> 900 hours. 
I don't know, like, do I even... What do we do with the reboot server chat? What do we do? Three more accounts to manage? You know what? I think the reboot server, we might play it a bit on scene on, at launch. And then I, I'm not going to continuously play it. And then we see what happens for global. All right, let's open that. Let's, let's open this. Let's see. More DC. We've been getting back to back to back to back DC now. Four, four times in a row. It's balancing out my bad karma from before. But I really want to cook an asthma on interview video. But like, I can't reach Hotha. All the people that ha I have connections with to this game, none of them have a direct connection with Hopper. Do I just like show up at their door and be like, you want, y'all want a fucking interview or not? <laughs> Visit their office? Oh, God. But like, I'm, I'm not going anywhere near them. And I only have one month in China. We'll see what the fuck happens. <laughs> Rent a truck? <laughs> Rent a truck. Do I go show up and be like, this dude wants to interview you, but none of you guys know English. So, uh... Yeah. And then, I've never revealed my face. So I j I'll just pose as a Hoppa, a Hoppa dev. And uh, take the interview myself. Act as imposter. Uh, <laughs> use voice changer? If he had mentor program, do you think he would have as much tanium as I got? Oh. I mean... He can just... Honestly? He can do... He can just be like, oh, here, here's a meet as by link. Right? My UID is here. You can just do this. Like, point to UID and be like, go to Midas by For spins. And then he'll get a shit ton. Yes, TOF2 is launching in three days, guys. It's actually happening. Like, Asmo can just beg for money. And, like, there's... If there's, like, 1% of his viewers that are stupid enough to give him money, he, he's already rich and swimming in Danium. It's, it's that simple. Fuck it, man. I can let the Tencent dude just... I can literally just let the Tencent dude know about this and then he'll, he'll fucking swipe for Asmon. It's like... Because, like, no one would know, right? 
<laughs> that's free marketing budget. That's like, that's like free marketing. You don't have to actually send bag. You're putting money from your left pocket into your right pocket. They'll just do it. If he plays, like, it's that simple. Where the fuck are my dreams? He had 30k viewers for Clash. I mean, if he plays Tov, there's got to be way more people watching. There will be way more Genshin, clueless Genshin Andes. Shitty on the game. And at least Tov is still in MMO, so like, yeah. His main target audience is still... MMO players. Whole year without new emotes? I literally just added a new emote yesterday. I don't know what you're talking about. Alright, what is this Clueless Sticks react? What is this? What is this? It's clueless Sticks react. What is this? Stand. The developers behind Tower Fantasy uh -huh. have stated that for some reason, the game is going to be running for at least another 10 years. And players are sitting there wondering to themselves, like 10 years, really? Not even Hoyo with Genshin has claimed it will exist for 10 years. Why on earth are they making such an unrealistic claim unrealistic maybe to make the community feel a little bit better with the new reboot server opening on or uh -huh. for the not really tower fantasy 2 but at the same time kind of a little bit tower fantasy 2 which but just it is worth noting of course it is not technically a sequel a completely separate alternate game rather it's going to be a another server that's running concurrently with this server i mean that's not wrong different not fake news overhauled. sure i i guess we'll find out exactly what that all means when they release additional information on it devil may cry peak of combat has i mean that that's okay sure i mean nothing nothing wrong with what he said not 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 really that clueless it's just The claim, the 10 year claim is very realistic for Perfect World to say, because that's literally what they do for all their fucking games. No matter how dead it is, their games still run. Huh? Yeah. Who the fuck are my dreams? Can someone tell me? Did they, did they delete dreams? Just like they they claimed in Tov 2, but accidentally for live. You're loving all the reboot changes? The reboot changes are good. The reboot changes are fine. As an existing player, it's fine. It's just like, why? Why not just change the existing server? Right, that's my dream. Like the balancing changes are fine. I'll take them. It's just like. What they're doing still doesn't make sense to me.
Is Toph 2 getting the 4.0 update? Okay, why are we talking about 4.0 update? And Toph 2 is getting literally everything. It's going to be updated in sync. With live servers, apparently. Huh? They're scared of paid players? Complaining about nerfing their paid weapons? It's that simple, right? You, they literally send out some fucking survey to their own paid players and look at what they say. They're not doing it, though. Because I, for one, won't give a shit. But, like, I, 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 I didn't get a survey. There's, like, what? There's, like, a total of, like, 10 paid players right now. Like, none of the actual paid players give a shit. I don't know what they're afraid of. Back to this. Thoughts? Three thousand eight hundred and twenty hours watched. What? How many hours has Sussy watched? Does mod view watch hours count? Three point nine. How do you have 3.9? Wait, how? That's an average of over 10 hours a day? What? <laughs> I don't even stream that long, besides fucking AFK sleep streams. The fuck? You're at 1.1. Most of that is because you keep my tabs open. Bruh. I mean, if you just keep the tab open, it's like free watch hours, but shit. Holy fuck, why? I wish I wish Twitch would actually give me a stat. Like some like ad revenue stat like how much ad revenue did i generate off of any specific viewer that would be funny to funny to find out that would be hilarious but that kind of a uh, that's kind of something they shouldn't like leak to like the general public because then they would fuck up all their relationships with their advertisers. It's 
See, this is this is what happens, right? No, no, no. Because basically, when if they do release those numbers, people will find out that, for example, okay, Sussy is here every fucking day. Or like, for example, Sussy's here every fucking day watching AFK streams, right? And then generated the most amount of revenue. And then Sussy can verify that he's never clicked on a single fucking ad. And then basically the advertiser will realize Twitch is wasting their advertisement money. Alright, finally. Last one. Also, if people see how much y'all make from ads, they will refuse to sub. No, this is the problem. See, Twitch has, all, has this all figured out. It don't matter how much you think I make from ads. Like, if I make, like, millions of dollars off ads. These people are still gonna sub because if they don't, they're gonna see more ads and make me more money. That's the problem. If you're here to watch, you sub because the fucking edge is a is something you don't want to fucking see. It's so bad on Twitch. I'm at the bare minimum right now, and it's still bad. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. MiHoYo popped off when they released Honkai Impact 3rd? You delusional or something? No, they didn't. There was only a select few weebs that played Honkai Impact, okay? The community was fucking tiny as hell. What are you talking about? Clueless Twitch viewers don't know about YouTube? YouTube delay and uh, YouTube chatters usually get donal lol. That's a problem. And I can't fix it. Like, people rather suffer through Twitch ads than watch on YouTube for a reason. Because YouTube is dog shit. I don't know why. But there's a reason. Wait, why the hell is Tuwa uh, alive? The fuck? The entire YouTube ecosystem is just terrible. The scrolling back in a video in a stream is really nice, actually. Like, there's some things YouTube has done right, but like... But only some things. Hata need to rework all game modes, add brand new ones. They literally are adding a brand new one called like biochemical collapse or whatever the fuck. Okay, I need to swipe actually. Two more days left. I'm going to forget. Why the fuck am I still swiping on this game, man? Oh well, it is what it is.
especially these I need to swipe for. This is important. This I can probably skip, honestly. I can safely skip this and be okay. Like, this is not necessary anymore. But, like, maybe next patch. Join all BR. What the fuck is BS? Balance sequential, balance realm, original war, others, even VAs, the same HP pool for bosses. No, actually, VA HP pool for bosses have all been steadily increasing every season. Problem here is uh, the increase is not enough to cover power creep. So the, so, the, so the mode just feels like shit and too easy now. Like the, the the content difficulty scaling isn't scaling proportionally to the power creep. BR is not hard. BR is not hard. No. No nothing. Like it's not hard. As in, like, it don't matter if you're a whale or not, right? This shit is not hard. You just you just do the same fucking rotation, unga bunga, and you clear floors until you can't clear anymore. Like, there is no skill involved, nothing. It's not hard. It's just a, a DPS check for your account. See how far you've gone. That's it. Right? The reboot server, ba the reboot server, bygone, is actually hard. As in, oh, kind of actually hard. They they cook like random bullshit and mechanics that you have to you have to figure out before you can clear. But like. Change Brevi. Did we get a Mimic Redeem? We had Ganono A0 like fucking hours ago. Okay, fine. Only Boundless Sequential Stage 6 is fun? I mean, if you find Boundless Sequential fun, they release a fucking new Boundless Sequential. Every character banner. We're on Boundless 11 now, after this patch. And it's new mechanics all the time. The problem here is I don't know what the fuck Tencent is doing. Because y'all are supposed to get Boundless 7. With the release of Nyan. Or like Altered Sequential 4. Like... They forgot about it, I think. Cause like every new banner, every new banner they, they add they add a floor. Then what about Alter? Where's Alter sequential four? Isn't Alter Sequential 4 non-existent? It's still stuck on floor 3? The whole point of Nyan release is Alter Sequential 4. Where the fuck is it? But yeah, they did cook a new a new game mode and apparently it shows up like uh, I don't know where it shows up. On the test server, it shows up in one of these tabs.
Devs forgot about the update? Like, okay. They, they, they say that they have a separate team for reboot server. They have a separate team for the live server. They have a separate team for global. But, like, you can clearly tell they don't from all the fucking scuff shit that they've done with managing the different versioning. No, they don't. It's the same fucking team. <laughs> like, I don't understand. Like, they do have, I mean, they do have, I think, 200-ish people now on their team. But, like, it don't matter how many people you hire. When the people, the person leading, the, like, management is shit. The more people you hire, the worse it gets. If your management is shit. Like, they actually do have that many people. That's not the problem here. Like, I, I do believe that they do have separate teams for different versions, but like, their upper management sounds like, at least from what we've experienced, is absolute, is, is pretty shit. From what, like, the decisions they've been making, the content they've been pushing out, how many bugs there are every fucking version. And like, how global updates have been all super fucking inconsistent and buggy every fucking time. Let me see. Do I need to buy more of these? Am I good with this? Wait. Can I just give him random garbage? So I'm done, right? 12 points. Okay, never mind. I thought I, I still got additional like event currency from this if I kept sending. Eventually, they will try this for global. Oh, they will try this for global. I don't know what you mean by eventually. If Asmon if interviewed, if Asmon interview went good, pity on how to invest money into them. Investing money into them doesn't solve the fucking problem, okay? They need someone to actually, like, know what they're doing. They're, like, super fucking clueless. Like... Like, they need direction. Like, even, even the people operating CN, like, CN players all agree that they're fucking... I don't know what their, their operation team is doing. They're so fucking Pepega all the time. Is it time to drop a couple million dollars and buy perfect world shares? Like... I don't... Fuck that man. I don't want extra fucking work. This is the thing. I'm only here for entertainment. I don't really give a fuck, okay? I don't give a fuck that much. I don't want to become an investor. I, this is not my job, okay? I don't give...
Like, I could, but why, right? Oh god, what the fuck happened to this UI? Wait. Okay, I think it's back to normal. The game is lagging for some reason now, all of a sudden. Are we done? I think we're done today. Nothing else to do, right? Did I do all my new week stuff? Okay, what is what is the raid? Is this bullshit? Fuck it, let's go. Do we have anybody for raid? Let's just fucking get it over with. Wait, no, I was swiping. What the fuck am I doing? I got sidetracked by chat. I was going to save raid attempt. You're right. I think that's enough. I don't need to swipe more. Is this enough? Everything else is cope garbage. So I have 200 more dollars. I don't know why you support this game. <laughs> no, I haven't burned out yet. I only stop playing when I burn out, but like... Papa updates fast enough for me to not burn out. I don't know. There's like new shit every month. Yeah, the dev team is fucking fast as fuck, but like, this is the problem. The dev team is fucking amazing. They can cook shit in like, um, they can cook all this shit in a month. Problem here is whoever is running the game for them is is absolutely fucking literally clueless. There we go, that's done. And there's free react content all the time like watching the clueless fucking community is is a game of itself okay, in itself okay They even said in the anniversary livestream that they haven't, they're not done with 3.6 yet, they're cooking with deadlines. Yeah, there we go. But imagine when they filmed that film for the anniversary, it was like probably a week earlier, at least, right? Unless they actually cooking with deadlines and they finished the live stream like, they filmed for the live stream like a day earlier. Maybe that's also the case, but who knows? We don't know what they're actually doing. Alright, and that's it. I'm done with CN. Nothing else to do. Wait, no, a new week. Let me buy this. Blame the guy who made Plotty's kit. Plotty's kit is good. Plotty is a very well designed character. I like, like. Uh, 
Like, she's good. Whoever cooked her up is did a great job. Uh, okay, fine. I'll just buy more of this. I don't want to actually farm. Uh, where's the shop again? Like the the fact that there's an extra shop in this page, and the UI is this stuff is like they need to hire a non Pepega UI UX director for their fucking game and entirely overhaul this thing. Like it's so bad. It is so fucking bad. Plotty phantom damage is still flame. Uh, she does flame and physical shot at the same time. That's kind of weird. I mean, why cook? Like, think about it this way, right? The only content where the phantom damage matters is... Like, for meta content, right? You're only doing one type of elemental damage anyways. Why not just double the damage and do physical and flame at the same fucking time? And then it'll be like, whatever. Like it don't it don't really matter. Uh where's my boxes? Like, fuck with all the, like, this. They, they used to cook, like, all the damage conversion, right? It'll match your active weapons, DPS, and whatever, and then they just got lazy and be like, why not just do the same damage twice with both elements? Like, who cares? In the content that does matter, one of them will just get resisted. It is what it is. No, the Phantom had a physical tick. I mean, we can go check right now. I'm done with CN, right? What other weekly stuff do I have to do? I got my dreams. Buy from shop before I fucking forget. MSEC? I don't do MSEC on ZN, there's no point. Feed fish? Oh, fish has been dead since, I don't know, like two months ago. The fish almost survived for a year. Almost.
How much does the biggest Tanium pack cost in Asia? What do you mean in Asia? What what in Asia? You talking about There's the global servers and there's the Chinese servers. I mean, what do you mean by Asia? Do you mean CN? You lost 50-50 on Dilok, will your next character be guaranteed? Sure. If you're talking about Genshin. Because on CN, the highest Tanium pack, I mean, in the game is still the same fucking shit. A hundred bucks. But there is a thousand dollar version if you swipe on the website. Not going to do Abyss after test server bullshit is done? Probably tomorrow. I'll play some Genjin. Get the Abyss over with. Body A1 is whatever. Let me let me go. Okay, we're done with CN. Fuck the quick test server check. Nope, no update. Amazing game. Uh, the thousand dollar bonus that like anything above a hundred bucks doesn't get double top up bonus in CN. I tried. Like the first time it came out, I swiped a thousand. Nothing happened. I did not get the double. Is the bonus DC? There's no bonus DC in CN. I don't know what you're talking about. What bonus DC? Alright, phantom background damage. How do we test phantom background I mean, we'll just be on flame, right? Let's do this. We'll be on we'll be on flame. And then we'll do some like new whole bullshit. New whole land. And then we just do like this. Phantom shows up. That's pure flame. Is it pure flame? Okay, that's pure flame.
No, no, it, it does do physical damage. Fuck, I can't get out of here anymore. Alright, let's go to Cactus. Okay, now we go to physical. Right, this is... Forget this. We do Zeke. Right, for sure this is physical now. Okay, and then... I don't know, how do you trigger this? Uh... I need something to do continuous damage. But then, I want to see the... whatever, I think this works. Okay, she's active. Okay, that's flame. See, there, there's a there's a physical tick. See? The passive does have a physical tick. Like, I don't know why, but it does do physical. And uh, I don't think it's said it's in the description anywhere. Right, it does 1800% attack damage. Every 8 seconds. Reduced to 6, I think? And then, let me see, uh, if your active weapon is just some random other element, let's do, say, Brevi. It's just flame. There's no fizz. I guess it's dependent on the active weapon you hold. Byling. Wait. No. Hold on. That's still flame. I think they forgot to cook synergy with others. Let's try Zeke. The fuck? Was that Yen Miao's passive doing the extra tick then? No, because there is a definitely an. Huh. Now that's only flame again. But the damage is...
What? I think this is passive. Any attack hitting the target will cause this passive. That's our pass. So her, her passive is useless for physical. No, but like the passive isn't the main point. She she is a physical buffer in the sense of her A3 giving you 25 damage and additional 18% physical damage. So like she buffs physical by 18 and that's all she does? Is that it? Oh, and also obviously the mirror reflection 15%. Anything else? I don't understand this. She has a resistance ignore, right? As well on the discharge. But it's only for flame resistance. Isn't flame just better? I mean, isn't Zeke just better than? Why would you even use her? Isn't Zeke like 80% snake chain? What did we cook on physical? So how is Zeke not better if we're definitely missing something?
看招，剑击看招，全力一击。Plotty did cook higher, but there was extra flame damage involved. So, literally no power creep. If I copied homework, is there homework to copy? None of that shit is real. We don't have anything to cook. Right? Let me see, let me see. Everyone was busy testing Rebu. Let me see if anyone posted uh, Kekta's numbers. Uh, we have people killing Cactus. There's no cactus available, chat. I don't know what this guy's cooking. He's trying to. This is a tutorial video. Any cactus? There's this one. Paimon cooked one. Paimon cooked a rotation for 14 builds. All right, let's see. Uh. Plotty Emiao Faisa. Plotty Nayin Faisa. Plotty Faisa Liu Huo. And. Okay. Alright, let's see. Let's see what he cooked. Here we go. Let's uh mute the damn game. Alright, we trust Paimon, right? Paimon, best cook in Tov. Okay. Let's see.
What in the fucking... Okay, good gameplay. Five K multiplier. Uh huh. Okay. I mean, he actually has a maxed flame account, so, and with all Titan stats. Was this day one where the cactus multipliers were bugged? When was this video? This was yesterday, right? Day one. I think this is when the multipliers were bugged. Like, don't believe in these. Don't believe in these numbers. That's 60 gigs. All right, this is the Nayan rotation. <laughs> they can still work to compare with each other because like some comps don't trigger the bug for me at least. I don't know why. Then maybe these four are comparable, we'll see. Body discharge applies the mirror passive. You only gotta do it once. You can refresh it with your skill if you have matrices on. Otherwise you can't jump cancel it. Otherwise, you just gotta let her discharge play through every two rotations, basically. Because each rotation is 20 seconds. The passive lasts 45 seconds. You just let the- you just let the discharge play once every two rotations. It just makes rotations scuffed. Yeah, this is with wine all buffs.
It's like literally the same fucking damage. Okay. Wait, what the fuck is Liu Hua doing here then? Passive damage? 16 pedal comp? What is this? That's only 13 this time. That's 13 pedals. Bruh, Faisa is like 30% of the damage. That's crazy. Did Paimon cook? They count as normal attacks, I'm pretty sure. Okay, this is obviously weaker. This is like 54. It seems like everything is viable. They're decently balanced together, I guess. Let's see how much this does. Did Yan Miao pillars get shafted is the real question. Doing dodge attacks is just to trigger Yami out passive. 
激情去。Okay, so flame mins can skip safely skip Yamil. I guess. Why do you need Yen Miao? You don't have to. No, no big difference. Well, I mean, if you look over here, Plotty Yen Miao Faisa did the most damage, right? Plotty Yen Miao Faisa, fifty nine. Point eight, and then face a uh, plotty Nayan did about fifty nine point two six. It's like same shit. Our face is bad because no dice. What the fuck are you talking? Why do we? Why does it stop bringing up? Next person that brings up dice gets fucking banned. Shut the fuck up. Stop being clueless. Next person that says dice is somewhat relevant and global is different because we have no dice. Can't do the same rotation. I'm a fucking ban you, okay? Forty percent. Okay. Where is his physical rotation, though? Did he? Is she even relevant for physical? We got nerfed. This is you can't. This is not achievable either. This thirty two hundred down to uh to two thousand, but the res resistance shred went up by ten. So where's the physical rotation? I need to see that. Physical. Oh wait, Paimon posted a uh, day two physical rotation, fifty six gigs. Okay, here we go. All right, here we go. We have a physical rotation. Ten hours ago.
He can dash way faster than me. Like, if you notice, he can do like six fucking dashes instead of mine only. Or like he does. How much can he do? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He can do eight. Like he can do one extra dash attack per rotation or two, I think. I mean, this is the exact thing I was doing. So, right, this did 56, but again, it's like flame physical. And also, if you if you looked over on the previous one, right? Like triple flame is should still be better. Right, cause isn't there Yemiao doing slightly? Wait, no. Right, Yemiao does slightly bit extra physical damage, just a bit more. So like, flame overall should have been basically on par if you're doing sequential, right? Oh well. But yeah, she didn't really do much for physical, honestly. What was the last physical rotation when Yamiel showed up? Uh, Paimon's been doing Crystal of, Crystal of Allen. Right, there we go. This is a Yen Miao Day 3.
This is a Yamiao day three test server. This did like 54. And then now we do 56, two gig more with Plotty. But then like her passive doesn't contribute to physical. So I don't even know if she's a, she actually, I don't think she even helps physical do more damage. So Plotty won't replace Liohua from flame meta. Where did you get that fucking conclusion? What? Where did that come from? Uh, compared to Zeke, there's a 4.5 gig gain. Okay, that's not, that's, that's, that's it. All right, forget this. Nothing going on. Test server patch didn't even fucking update. Uh. Yeah, 4.5 gig gains for Zeke, for Fizz, Zeke to Bloody. But like, we know that her passive does 1800 multiplier every six seconds of flame damage. I don't think it helps. I don't, the, the damage number is kind of inflated. What's up with Reddit? Is Reddit dead? Is it just me? Hello? Or is it actually dead? Reddit is dead for you too. Okay. Seems good. Yeah, th th that's it. I'm done. Finish the in shit as well. All right. Nothing to do. Let's raid out. Quick, a quick G, G game dailies. It's 10 a.m. in the fucking morning. Is there a test tomorrow? There should be. It says it lasts until the 12th. Quick G game dailies again, as usual. The usual G game daily session. Let's raid. And then let's raid out. Uh, tomorrow, if there's nothing to test, we'll probably do Abyss. Alright, daily's done. Let's raid. Where are we going? Uh, hold on, daily's not done yet. Genshin... Fuck it. Here we go. Check in. Star Rail. Okay, done. All right, now let's read. Uh, Cherry's still alive. Where are we going? 
Yeah, so t tomorrow we might do a biz. Lego Fortnite. I don't know, maybe we'll play something else when we have more time. Because, like... We'll figure something out. The Cherry just start? I just raided her yesterday. It was fucking... Back-to-back -back raids are fucking weird, man. Who it is? Short stream today. Who the hell is this? I've never been here before. Alright, send. Never been here before, I don't think. It says short stream. Let's see if it's actual short stream. She She's reacting. She's reacting to all the characters, okay. Alright, kick by. See y'all tomorrow. First time she's not on Genshin, okay? And she gets a raid, alright? Okay, bye. See y'all tomorrow.